Hey. How we doing? We good? We're ready for some more... Termina? How you doing, Carla? Um... So, last time, uh, actually right at the end, we... We, uh, prayed to Sylvian. And... All of our limbs were healed. So, it actually wasn't a completely wiped run. We did lose Maranara. She's dead. Unfortunately. But everyone else is at tip-top health. So I think... Um, I think the next the next step is just getting out of the basement. I think we're just stuck in the basement now. Um, yeah, so I'd really like to gun to get a an ending today. Um... Like, because the next, the next step is finding three totems. We've got one totem in the basement of the church. Um, oh, shit. Hey, Lappin, how you doing? Lappon Kotsu. I didn't spell that right. Hang on. <laughs> Lappon Kotsu. There we go. Uh, have we met before Lappon Kotsu? Toontown? What's Toontown? Hello everyone, um, if you've just come from Toontown, um, what we're about to play today is the exact opposite, um, in almost every single way. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. uh, I, I am the opposite of Lappin, Lappin Kotsu, and this game is the opposite of, of Toontown. So, um... Although you'll be pleased to note that people do get hit in the face with cream pies in both games. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to get straight into it. Uh, yeah, this one. This one. Well, you get... Something that's close enough. Um, okay, so last time our third party member died, uh, Marinara. Um, Levi had his legs broken, uh, but we had them healed by praying to a god. So we're not in the worst spot. I would have preferred uh, Marina not, not be dead. But... You know, we take what we can get. What kind of pie? Uh, well, it's sort of uh, an alien face hugger. Hits you in the face. And then squirts some sort of substance down your throat. Um, now where are we going? Where are we going? No, not here. So, we need to find... Um, so we got the, the totem in the Church of Ormir, and we need... Uh, some of these other totems too. Jesus, how do we get all the way back up there? This is taking so long. Okay. And yeah, when we were in the, uh... In the church, because we... Oh, Jesus. Okay. Attack him in the guts, please. Attack him in the guts, please. Okay. There we go. See, this guy's unique. That enemy is unique because... It, um, usually you have to break their limbs and stuff like that before actually attacking them. And he's he's the exact opposite. You just, you just attack his guts and he goes down. Uh, you can have that. And you... Can have... How can a disabled person? Um, actually, she's handy capable, um, and apparently she's quite strong. But every other every other turn, she gets knocked out of her goddamn wheelchair and has to spend a turn getting back into it. So I'm not I'm not sure. Actually, what weapon does she have? Uh, no, she's got an axe. Okay. I did have another girlfriend who could use black magic, but then she got killed by her ex-girlfriend turned into some sort of weird god thing. 
um, that killed her and then possibly resurrected her as a ghoul. Um, oh, go away, go away, go away. So yeah, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Uh, do I want to deal with this? You know what, let's just take him out. Okay. Nice. Happens all the time with exes. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Oh, no. Please. Oh, yeah, thank God. Thank God. Um, I didn't... I wasn't paying attention and he put the bear trap down. If you don't kill him that turn, then you just didn't get owned by the bear trap. Thankfully, I've got some decent weapons at the moment. And even just having a second person on your team makes this game a lot better. Can I do anything here? No. Um, we're pretty far in. I think I'm up to the second, the second half of the game at the moment. It feels like this is sort of like the last thing you do before the, the very final boss. That being said though, this game is weird. Very weird. So, who knows what's going to happen. And we may even run out of time because... Give me some blue vials. Um, yeah, kind of this one. I just want a whole bunch of blue vials, really. Okay. Cool. Yeah, this game has just been uh, kind of insane the entire time. Um... So I honestly don't know what's going to happen. Um, we are right here, so I suppose we'll go this way. Oh, and there's like nightmare police that have three limbs that grow back when you fight them. Oh. Where are we going? Church of Ormir, we went there. Residential District. St. Demex Orphanage. We actually need to go to the Residential District and the Orphanage. Oh, what the fuck is this? Oh god, it's Pocket Cat! Oh shit, he's here! He's here, he's really here, guys! Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Uh, <laughs> um, if you know who Pocket Cat is, then you know exactly what's in that bag, and I don't want to say it. There's a tall man here wearing what seems to be a rubber mask. Oh. Oh. Here I am, busy with my own business, completely ignoring this beautiful chap. All apologies. Pleased to meet you. You can call me Pocket Cat. You have one of those familiar faces. I feel we've met somewhere before. Perhaps in a past life? Uh, you know what? I have actually met him, so I'm going to say maybe. Things sure have changed since then, haven't they? We live in peculiar times. The world has gone through true darkness. The world has been at a standstill. In a deep rest. People stocked up on toilet paper and hid in their homes with their loved ones. They were waiting for that glimpse of light just because they knew that even the darkness has a breaking point. Very meta character in this one. Was he so meta in the first game? I'm trying to remember the conversations with him. Say, old sport, what do you think of think follows such intense darkness? Hmm, it has to be light, more peaceful times. The darkness isn't quite over yet. Well, no, it isn't quite over yet growth into something new. Yeah, Termina is basically about a pandemic of some sort of weird moon disease, right? And the, and the cops, yeah, the cops running around the town beating anybody who's outside. <laughs> the darkness isn't quite over yet. Well, ain't she a killjoy? But I understand, I understand. Dark times create dark minds. Hey, Marky, how you doing, man? From personal experience, I'd say true darkness is followed by chaos. The mind, or the common consciousness we all share, strives for something new. 
when one is truly done with darkness, one strives for new with such vigour that growing pains are inevitable. But there lies the danger. You see, chaos can ragdoll us into any one direction. The direction is not always towards the light. Sometimes one can find themselves lost in a limbo that is the chaos. When you enter the limbo from a dark place, there is a big chance that you contaminate the chaos with your darkness and just create a new pitch black place. Maybe even darker than the one before. Interesting. I guess I'm just rambling here. Letting my mind wander and mouth slander, as they say. You know me. When I get excited, I can go on and on and on. I didn't mean to take your time. From what I understand, you've got your hands full with the festival already. So I'll get straight to the point. Not only a wandering gentleman, but I'm also a head salesman of sorts with deep, deep pockets. What is a head salesman, you ask? Well, it is exactly what it sounds. I'm willing to part from my valuable collection if the price is right. And the price is severed heads of those participating in the festival. Macabre, I know. But you get used to it. God knows I did. God. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is the least fucked up thing he's done in the games, by the way. Trading heads. In the first game, it was much, much worse. Much worse. <laughs> this is what I have to offer. It is quite a nice collection, even if I do say so myself. What do you want to trade them for? Oh, he, he, sells, he sells books. Oh, that's useful. That's really useful. Um... But it needs a lot of heads, so jeez. Okay. Interesting. Inter he he has changed. He's grown as a as a a, a person, a, a cat. He's grown as as a creature. So now he just wants multiple people dead instead of, yeah. Okay, so because all these books are all really really mechanically useful for you, uh, except the Book of Enlightenment. I don't know what that does, um, but it, it's probably useful. Yeah, you changed, bro. You used to be cool. <laughs> so I was, I was wondering how, how you would be able to get them because, like, these ones give you really useful recipes. Um, and these ones give you uh, uh, runes that you can do stuff with. But they're, they're random otherwise, so... Happy to do business with you. It truly was a pleasure to meet you once again, but I fear I must go for now. The tower you were heading towards is to the east of here, just beyond the church's hidden passage. What? It's through the church. Well, that's actually really useful information, Pocket Cat. I didn't know there was a hidden passage. Let us meet again there. Perhaps I'll even have a special deal for you. My pockets are very deep, you see. But until that time, old sport, take care, take care. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here because Needles is coming. hidden passage in the church. I thought I poured over that church and found n nothing like that. Maybe I didn't. Maybe it's downstairs, actually. In the in the basement. Maybe it's in the basement. Only a lone wind howl accompanies you in these empty alleyways. Okay. 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 What's going on here? What's going on here? Let's poke around a little bit. Oh, shit! Shit, what is that? Don't kind of don't want to deal with that, and I don't want to deal with needles. I don't know where needles is, but he just arrived. Whenever that laughter Whenever that laughter appears, that means needles is Needles has just arrived in the scene. And he's coming to to absolutely own you. Let's go in here. If you if you just if you just change maps, then it, it just resets. Resets. Uh, do I want to go in there? It doesn't really look like I want to go in there. So I'm going to say no. Yeah, if you change maps, um, then uh, needles resets. So it's pretty easy to like avoid him, but you need to avoid him. What did the pocket kitty do in the first game? Yeah, he, he did. He traded really valuable goods in the first game. Um, and we'll leave it at that. Can we go upstairs? We can't go upstairs. Okay. 
the fuck was that? All right, let's just use let's use the key here. Let's see what's in here. Such a luggage booby trap. What's what do we do with that? Wide vial, nice. Body is in a horrible condition. It's impossible to tell what has happened to this person. Okay. Oh shit! Oh shit! Can we dodge? Can we... Did we just dodge that? Yeah, we did. Sick. Get owned. Get outplayed. Goddamn nerd. Ha <laughs> ha. Get owned. It's RPG maker. The AI of, of wandering enemies is sometimes a bit wonky. Okay. Oh, what the fuck is that thing? God, I don't want to deal with it. Uh, go away, man. Go away. Can we interact with this? Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! He's there! He's there! He's there! He's there! He's there! Nope! 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 We do not want to fight needles because he's an absolute machine. <laughs> God damn it! God damn it! God damn it! God damn it! 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 Needles came waltzing to meet you. God. <laughs> this fight is ridiculously hard, and I don't want to do it. Um. Please run, please run, please run, please run. Yes, good, good, good. Can we, have, where do we go? Where do we go? Wait, no, no, we can, we can go back where needles came from. Ugh. A striking stench follows a hound that just approaches you. We're just gonna run, I don't wanna deal with these guys either. You feel nauseous just being close to the creature. Oh, that's gross. Fecal hound, oh my God. Revel in feces. Oh god. No, 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 don't infect, don't infect, don't infect. Please don't infect. Please don't infect, please don't infect. Ah, oh, god damn it. God damn it. They did, they shitted. They shitted all over us. Can we actually not escape? Oh. Oh, this guy's actually kind of easy. You know what? Uh, the other dogs were really easy too. The dogs seem to be way easier in this game. Oh god. Let's go, let's go, let's go. No, 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 no. Oh, Pocket Cat killed that one. What the hell? Not Pocket Cat, uh, Needles. Okay, okay, okay. Let's deal with this infection. Um. This should be fine. Nausea, nausea should just go away by itself. Hey, thank you for the follow, Mia. Um, do I need the white vial for anything actually? No, not really. So I'm just gonna, I'll just use the white vial to get rid of this nausea just in case, because I've got a million of these things. And they're kind of useless otherwise. But Olivia is fine actually because she heals by herself. So she can have a meat pie. She's been a good girl. She can have a meat pie. There we go. As a treat, Olivia can have a pie. Oh, we've got another white vial. There you go. Uh, I kind of don't want to go in there. Oh, my goodness gracious. Smoko time. Yeah, let's go. Have a pie and an iced coffee. Yeah, no, no, this isn't going to be creepy at all. This isn't going to be a nightmare. I will take some money though, if that's okay. Oh, you can't. Oh, that sucks. Where's a durry? Yeah, 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 get her a durry. Man, this must have taken so long to make all this stuff. Like, unique assets for, like, a single shop. Why is this music going off? Uh... 
Um. Okay. What is that? What is that? Um, it's just clothes. Yeah, I guess, but like, what is it? So I have murky bar. If it's if it's an enemy, that means it's probably really flammable. Okay, we can deal with that. We can deal with that. Irregular obelisk stands tall. Attack her. Investigate. You don't know why, but it feels like the obelisk is staring at you constantly without blinking her eyes. It's not a nice feeling. No, fuck it. Let's go. Let's go. Why is Olivia triggered by this? She has erotophobia. This isn't very sexy. Um, okay, so actually, let's let's talk to it. No. Skills, talk. Let's find out what, what's actually going on. And Olivia, what you can do is you can throw the murky vial at it. What are you? What's the meaning of this? Why now? Why here? Why? Oh man, this... <laughs> what are you? Dot, dot, dot. You ask, but the obelisk gives no answers. Oh, we're stealing mind damage. Okay. Oh! The murky vial just ex explodes on contact. It doesn't, like... Hmm. Well, Olivia, you're going to heal because you're very low. How did that miss? This is a pillar of clothes. Jesus, that's doing a lot of mind damage. Um, okay. Let's try talking again. Um, you can... Actually, just attack. Just attack. What is the meaning of this? Dot, dot, dot. You ask for the obelisk, gives no answers. Shivers. Okay. Let's go. Choo choo. Nice. Nice. A lot of damage, a lot of damage. It keeps casting shivers though, and I don't really like that. Um, let's try talking again. And you can get a little bit drunk to calm your mind. Why now? Dot dot dot. Nice. Nice! And it missed. Um, talk again, and you can just... What does matches do? Let's find out what matches. Oh, can we even use matches here? Uh, can be used to throw at enemies for a small fire attack. Oh yeah, let's do that. Oh, what does this do? Canister with a good amount of gasoline inside. Yeah, we use that. Why now? Why here? Dot dot dot. You ask, but the obelisk gives no answers. Okay. Skills, talk. Item... Ornamental letter. Why? No answers, okay. <clears throat> Sick, it keeps missing. I'm very happy about that. Rev up, rev up, rev up, attack. Boom, go. You can rev up, rev up, rev up and attack as well. I don't know why we're attacking a big pile of clothes, but it it feels right. It feels right. It keeps missing. This is awesome. And you can use Ornamental Lantern again. Let's go. Yeah, I did. I, did. I asked all of them, I'm pretty sure. Shivers 2. Ooh. Item, Ornamental Lantern. Let's go. I might save a couple of those just in case for another fight. Okay. Let's go. Rev up, rev up, rev up, and attack. So we're just we're just sitting here wailing on a big pile of clothes, and it's and it's basically just creeping us out. Is basically what's happening. That's what I liked about these games. And, you know, I'm sure other games do it too. But it, it's good at presenting these situations like this because it has the mind stat where just this weird stuff is happening and it's just freaking your characters out. Let's 
Maybe not. Boom, 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 boom. How much health does this thing have? It could, it could honestly just be um, our characters going insane. Like the, the characters just like losing their minds in the middle of preheval, which is honestly <laughs> kind of likely. It's kind of likely. Um, you give ba -ba 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 Levi a drink. But also, um, there is something underneath the clothes, so... My favourite fight. You, you can sort of see, I'm not sure how, my, how well it's going to come through in the stream quality, but there's like, you can sort of see weird tentacles underneath it. My favorite fight in any RPG ever is in the first game. There's, um, you fight this, uh, this floating severed head and it's like a wizard, but he summons this creature to fight with him and it's the darkness behind him and that's the enemy. And then this thing gets closer and closer. You see the eyes getting closer and closer and eventually it emerges. It's so well done. It's awesome. And I'm hoping there's something like that in, in here. But it's like, once, you, once you've done it, just doing the same thing again is like, well... Nashra, that's his name, yeah. Oh. Man, how much health does this thing have? It's gonna turn into a Zatsadan at this point. Slowly chipping away at at mind. Hmm. I don't think this is an enemy you can beat. It's almost like it's here to make you lose time until you lose your mind. It might. It honestly might be. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it's 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 accurate. Heal mind? No, we can go. We can go one more attack if we need to. Okay. So sitting here in the darkness, beating clothes like an insane person. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, actually, this I don't mind doing this because um, I ordered some Maccas takeaway, and I only just arrived like a minute before stream. So this gives me a, an opportunity to have a bit of a bite to eat. Definitely going to. Oh, Levi was actually close to going insane there. Um, um, you can have vodka as well, Olivia. Actually, nice. Did I have to tell you what the definition of insanity is? <laughs> yeah, 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 basically. <laughs> Streaming for half an hour and 20 minutes of it has been fighting this thing. <laughs> I 
<sighs> I kind of, I kind of want to look up and see if if I'm doing the right thing. Irrational obelisk. But I also don't want to have spoilers. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna Google it real quick, real quick. Wait, is anything even gonna... You know, a lot of stuff doesn't even show up for this game because it's so new and it's like, it's pretty niche. Uh... <laughs> One of the first things that... I think the only thing that came up that actually mentions the obelisk is a, is a 4chan thread. And there's no responses. Wait, the, the, the wiki's up for Fear and Hunger 2. No way. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah, it's, it's for the first game, not for the second game, unfortunately. Wow, okay, so yeah. Can someone kill this irrational obelisk? I lost like two hours and can't kill it. He's got more than one million HP. Okay. So we're not going to continue fighting this. I'll try talking to it again. Um, yeah, you do that. What's the meaning of this? Why now? Why here? Never mind. Is never mind a permanent option you have? Yes, it is. Okay. Okay, we'll ask why. We'll ask why. Why? You ask, but the obelisk gives no answers. Okay. It's, I reckon it's probably something like if you ask questions in a specific way, then it does something. Like it, it transforms or something. It, it, yeah, it, honestly, it could just be me going insane. So um, let's just let's just get out of here. You picked up the unused gas. What this is the gas? Oh, I dropped that. Right, that's weird. I thought we threw it at the dude, but I guess not. Well, okay, um, we'll put that on the list of what the fuck. Okay, um, and we lost, we're just standing there, going insane in the dark, beating on a big pile of clothes. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Excuse me? Temple district, business district, orphanage. We want to go to the orphanage and get the fuck away from whatever this is. Go away, 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 go away. Oh, we missed, uh, we missed that thing that we want. Why here? Why now? Move it. Nope, 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 nope. I don't want to deal with whatever that is. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to, no, 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 no. Stop that, stop that, stop that. You get stuck on stuff easily, I find. Can we go down? No, this is how we came in. Can we go this way? Nope, we cannot. How the hell do you get to this, the second thing then? Because we're like... Here. Is it... No, I, I want to get this thing first. In the middle of the map. So, did the dogs have anything? Oh, they will not have anything. Yeah, I didn't think so. Don't tell me we need to go through this. Whoa! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! What? 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 Oh my god! Oh my god! Did that dude have a fucking drill? And then they lock me in here. Oh my god! What was that? <laughs> Jesus. Um, okay. You don't- Honestly, look, if you get caught by that crowd, it wouldn't shock me if there's a scene where they drill out your teeth. 
Fuck, dude, no way you get out of this in one piece. Well, well, I have already lost lost my legs, and then only by a miracle. Master key, sick. Useful. Only by a miracle, a literal miracle, did I get my legs back, so. <laughs> and Sylvian didn't heal the wheelchair girl. Get owned. That's so cruel. <laughs> Wait, the TV's on? There are shapes forming in the chaos. PLTV News, Karen Sauer. Oh, here we go. Shocking acts of crime in the heart of preheval. I love this dude's art style, it's so good. Commentating the events here at preheval, Bohemia, is Karen Sauer. Good afternoon. Yeah, one of the playable characters. A murder so heinous and perplexing in all its particulars has never before been committed in the city of Preheval. The tragedy of 28th Street. This most extraordinary and frightful affair that transpired here in the heart of the city baffles the residents of the apartment building to no end. Oh god. Oh my god. A, a murder so, so shocking that they sent in a foreign correspondent to have a look at it occurred in this building and now to defy the laws of physics because the power isn't on the tv is showing it to me so yeah okay we got ghosts here that's good that's good the person held in charge of this crime was said to have never been a suspicious one all the residents describe him as a calm individual who liked to keep to himself most of the time regardless of his outward persona inside this man was a monster the residents of apartments 2, 6, 11, and 13. Let's write these down. 2, 6, 11, 13. We're all murdered in the most gruesome manner. Okay, television screen is filled with nightmares. Okay, so this is going to be a nightmare. Oh, wait, what? The books are growing together because of the white crust that is covering this entire building. Is this going to be a horror game? A horror game stuck in my in my survival. I, I guess I guess fear fear and hunger is a is a horror game. Okay, so let's go upstairs. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a different style of horror in in this horror game. Okay, what's this apartment two? All right, all right, all right. Let's try not to get brutally murdered here. Moldy bed here. You can sleep and rest if you wanted to. Though every alarm bell is ringing in your head when it comes to this apartment. When even the game is like, do not sleep here. Do not sleep here. <laughs> no, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Sealed shut. <laughs> I'm not doing it. I'm gonna get absolutely brutally murdered. I oh, like, yeah, sure, there were ghosts in the first game, but it wasn't like a. Uh, this is a different kind of horror, you know. Oh, what is that? What is that? Okay, so he saw me. Um. If he comes in, I'm just going to have to fight him. But hopefully I'm far enough away that he deagros. And he's gone. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Dev uploaded the video of him drawing this one. Oh, interesting. I wouldn't mind seeing that, actually. It's crawling on all fours. Uh, I don't want to know. Sleep in not safe. No, I don't care. I don't care what the poll is. I'm not doing it. Okay, so this is apartment six is the music room. Okay, so six is music room. I'll just write this down, music. Just in case, because there's some reason that 
these are marked. We, we can't actually go into the other rooms. Was there anything special about room two? Let's see, let's see. There's a comfy chair. That does actually look pretty fancy, doesn't it? Um, comfy chair and plants. Okay, plants. We'll say plants. Chair and plants. Yes, it's totally safe. <laughs> I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. Because then we'll get murdered by whatever the hell that thing is. Okay. And I don't feel like getting murdered, so. Okay, 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 okay. Four. Oh, we can go in here. No, we can't go in there. Okay. There's a portrait of a young man on the table. This person has his face scratched, scratched over. Take the portrait. Find the portrait of a young man. Yeah, why not? You know what? You know what? Portrait of a young man. I don't know why we have this. Why do we have this? All right. Uh, we can't get any of these books. All right. It's, to it's not totally safe and I'm not doing it. Where did he go? He must have gone back upstairs. Oh, okay, well, I'm getting pretty sleepy, so let's rest for a bit. It's so quiet and peaceful. You fall asleep immediately. Wow, that's nice. You could sleep here forever. Just forget the outside world and stay in bed. Oh, God. You became a permanent part of the sleeping house. Yeah, okay. 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 <laughs> it was a remarkably peaceful way to die. I'll give it that. Um, oh, Jesus. Where am I now? Uh, let's see if we can find a better way out of this, out of this place, than going all the way back down to Old Town, because I don't want to do that. Are you fucking telling me there's a stairs right here and I didn't realise? I am such an idiot. So I wonder where this secret... This, they said there's a secret passage in here. So I wonder where that might be. Because I kind of need the secret passage to get to... To get to the temple. Maybe they'll just tell us. Because if, if you need it to finish the game, then obviously they're just going to tell you, right? Okay, where the fuck am I? Where the fuck am I? Meat pie. Yum, yum, yum. We didn't go this way before, so I'm just going to go this way. Since you guys got me killed, we're going to do something different now. It's my choice. Eastern outskirt. Interesting. Tranquil lake. An empty basket. Whoa! Who's shooting? Oh, fuck. Oh, what a chad. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, God. I don't want to fight this guy. Jesus, look at him. Uh... You know what? No, actually, you know what? Let's fight him. Let's fight him. Since, because we, we just... Attack his... What do we got? What do we got? His right arm. We're not going to be able to damage that. So let's go his gun arm. Okay. What's going on here? Stay away. I mean no harm. Prepare to die, Bremen scum. <laughs> uh, what's going on here? Dot, dot, dot. 
She shows absolutely no reaction to your words. Okay. Low bayonet. Oh. Oh, Christ. He raises his shield for defense. <laughs> okay. Um, try talking to him again. If I die, I die, right? Okay, so it's entirely defensed up. Stay away. I mean no harm. Dot, dot, dot. Okay. Oh. Jeez. Okay. Okay, this is... Can I actually equip anything? That's one-handed. This, this is one-handed as well. Okay. Okay. Um, and you... Just attack his arm again. Okay. Low bayonet. Lost a leg. Oh, that's, that is perfectly fine. Oh god, what is he doing? Oh, thank God. Oh. <laughs> okay, yeah, right. So when his arm twitches, that means he's about to do a kill attack next turn. Okay, so let's try... Let's, we'll try talking to him one more time and we'll try threatening him. Prepare to die, Bremen scum. Nah, doesn't care. Absolutely no sell. Lost her other leg. Oh, no. Oh, no, guys. The girl in the wheelchair who can't use her legs lost her legs. But she's actually going to bleed to death really soon. So let's give her... Give her... I don't have a really big heal, do I? No. Um, you get blue vial. Well, it's better than nothing, I guess. Wow, okay. So this guy is just a, a limb-eating machine. Jesus. Let's see what happens if we throw glass shards at his head. Okay. Because apparently that can blind people, so if that works, that would be very useful. Okay. Low bayonet. Stop hitting her legs. Oh my god. Didn't she already lose her left leg? Face mask protect. Okay, so he can't get blinded. Um, ba, 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 ba. we do actually want to heal her up quite a lot. So what we'll do is we don't have any left. God damn it. Okay. So she's dead next turn, but that's okay. Um, instead, what we'll do is Levi will rev up. He'll rev up and he'll... She has three legs. Oh, God. Rev up. Wow, his arm is really strong. Tube's arm twitches, so now we guard this turn. Miss. Okay, um... Boo, 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 boo. Oof, that didn't do much damage. Are we supposed to take out the shield first? Lost his other, and lost another leg. God. Even if we win this fight, it's just a, it's a wash. Wow. Okay. So that took so much damage to take out that arm, and he's still gonna be able to probably shield bashes too. So, um, let's try legs. Okay. Oh, there you go. Literal shield bash. Jesus, three attacks? Wow, even more. Wow, three attacks and the leg isn't isn't broken yet. My god, this guy's cracked. <laughs> oh my god. That's it. Wow. What an absolute tank. So basically, 
unless your party is cracked, don't take on the elite trooper. Yeah, yeah, truly elite. He really was. Uh, it would probably be a lot easier if I had uh, Marinara with me. Because three attacks per turn is actually quite effective, even if they're really weak attacks. Um, but, yeah, still. That's wild. Um, well, what we'll do is... Oh, that's right. He's probably, yeah, not very strong against magic. So hurting would probably go a long way in that fight. And, and uh, I mean, hurting goes a long way in every fight, right? Um, but maybe, because she has, what does she start with by default? Uh, Pyromancy Trick. That would probably be good. Well, we have some of that armor. So we can see what it's good against. Everything. It's good against everything. What am I, why am I surprised? It has no weaknesses. Good. <laughs> it's it's effective against fire. Okay, so it would just be magic, right? It would just be magic it's good against. Not, not even Pyromancy Trick would do much to it. So... So yeah, hurting. You go in there with hurting or you just die. And she doesn't even start with hurting, so you need to level her up first to get it. Um, okay, 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 okay. Let's not go straight down to the waterfront. We probably just avoid him, but uh, I want to poke around here first, see what's what's what. Just some stuff here, it looks like. Okay. Good scab grab location. Don't mind if I do. I hope Needles doesn't spawn here. I don't want to deal with him right now. Can we sneak around? We can sneak around. Awesome. Is this a lucky coin? Hell yeah. Let's go. Portrait of a young man on top of a drawer. The f oh, another one. That's interesting. Film room. Oh, where did we see the um 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 the projector? That was in the bunker. Interesting. Okay, I don't feel like going and doing that right now. But <clears throat> someone's diary. I feel the rope tightening around my neck with each passing day. The city has always been narrow-minded and bigoted. If you didn't follow the doctrine to a T. You'd be persecuted to no end. The priests don't encourage this behaviour with words, but they don't have to. Centuries of inbreeding and inward looking has created an atmosphere where there is no room for deviation, let alone criticism. The mob mentality takes over the town at regular intervals, and the gallows becomes familiar to every non-conformist. I've seen this happen time and time again, yet for some reason I never imagined becoming the next in line to go. So here we are now. I saw the signs. I'll prepare for my leave. In the meantime, I take temporary shelter at these outskirts. The moon is awfully high tonight. I hear noises echo from the heart of the city. The mob gathered around that hollow tower. The high priest will have his speech there. I fear that I lingered for too long. I should have left the city years ago already. Can we just sneak? No, 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 no. He's fast, he's fast, he's fast, he's fast, he's fast. No, ah. Up here, up here. Go, 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 go. Go away, go away, go away. There's nothing here, there's nothing here, there's nothing here. Okay, let's just get the fuck out of here. Because we're not going to be able to do anything to him. Good, 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 good. Okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, 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 go. Is there anything down here at all that we can, like, do? <clears throat> What's up here? What's up here? Cool. Metal box has some fire extinguisher equipment. Okay, no, no, no. Oh, God. So this place is just for this fight. So there's basically nothing else here, it seems. Well, I, I guess other than getting the... Um, Other than getting the uh, film reel. Oh, can I not escape now? Am I just not allowed to escape? <sighs> oh, 
Let's just see what this attack does. Rapid fire. Oh my god. That wasn't as bad as other coin flip attacks. I guess if you've got a full party, that's like 80 damage straight up. So that's a fair amount of spread out damage, but it's not... Compared to other coin flip attacks, it's not that bad. Just kill me, please. Just kill me, please. So the only reason to come down there is the film reel, and do I care about the film reel at the moment? Not really. I wouldn't mind seeing what's on it, but... I'm more concerned about just getting an ending than figuring out everything to do with this game in a single playthrough, right? <clears throat> and, you know, we've already missed some stuff that... Well, there's plenty of stuff that we're just not going to be able to figure out. Because we're already, like, halfway through the first day. Second day. It's, it's so funny that Sylvian doesn't heal her legs. That's just so cruel of Sylvian to do that. <laughs> I'm the goddess who can heal all injuries if, if I like you. No, no, actually, I don't like you. <laughs> um, okay, so was there anything else down that way? I don't think there was. So now we just go left and we'll try and we'll try and find another way to the tower. I don't think there is one, but we'll see. We'll poke around. We'll poke around. Whoa, 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 Don't do that, you son of a bitch. Fucking yellow mages. Are you kidding me? Ah, go away, go away, go away, go away. No, 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 no. How did he catch me? All right. No, goodbye. 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 We're not dealing with this. Can I? Can I? I couldn't leave. Okay. Okay, good. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Um, uh, up, 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 down here. Yes, 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 yes. And then, no, I've already killed that one. Maybe they respawn. I thought I killed it. Maybe I didn't. Okay. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me, you son of a god damn it. <clears throat> Not this way, down here. Man, that's nasty. Okay. Oh, she's hungry, isn't she? Um, okay. Um, let's have a bite to eat real quick. I'm not giving you moldy bread. Actually, can we cook anything? No. <laughs> Food. And you can have that. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, we're back here. We're back here. And, oh, we need to, we're going to meet uh, Pocket Cat again. Had I known Pocket Cat was here, I would have met him yesterday before I saved. <laughs> Some chippies. It's not a rubber mask, by the way. Hmm. Oh yeah. I like doing the same answers as the ones I first picked. Just because I, I like... I don't want to like get too much content on my first playthrough. 
Bye, mister. <laughs> yeah, the, um... The secret passage must be underground. In the basement. Right, right, right. And then we went up here and then we went down into... What's here? Old apartments. That was right. That was a creepy... The creepy ghost or whatever. And there's just nothing interesting there. Um, this is Final Fantasy 2, actually. Um, secretly the best one. Um, now we had to fight the shit dogs. Oh, did that not kill it? Shit. Don't you dare infect me. Don't you dare. Oh, god damn it. God damn it. Okay, 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 that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Nice, 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 nice. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Good, owned. Um, I don't know if you could trigger the fight there. Okay, so we need to deal with this infection. Um, <coughs> uh, <coughs> oh, excuse me. How do we deal with that again? It is green herb. Yep. Okay. If you don't deal with an infection, um, <laughs> so there are, there are multiple ways to deal with the infection, right? You can use something that cures you, like a green herb or, or something like that. Um, or you know, there's other there's other healing items that help. Or, um, or you can cut the limb off. Okay, there we go. Or you can cut the limb off. Um, if you don't deal with the infection, then it will kill you. Oh, there's a basement here. We didn't check this out last time. Sure you can, just cut off, yeah. I'm not gonna cut off my leg. Something reeks down here. This whole city stinks. It just stinks. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Something stomping around. Oh god, okay. Washing machine is shaking violently. There's a padlock with a mechanical four digit code keeping the lid closed. <clears throat> Investigate. Glass window is dirty with murky liquids foaming inside. Someone's fucking head is in there. Force it open. Can we do that? Oh yeah, no, no, we're, we're not gonna, not gonna be able to do that. You need like four crits with excellent weapons to to actually succeed at doing that. It's it's really it's really difficult to actually force stuff open that way. Um, okay, so we'll keep in. Hang on, four digits, four digits. Let's see, let's see what what possible what possible numbers we can enter. Because we have four digits. Set a password. Yeah, okay, so two, six, eleven, thirteen. No. It is a really weird mechanic. And I'm not entirely sure why it's there. But, whatever. It, it doesn't like detract from the game or anything, so I don't. I'm not really worried. A 
Is there something this way? They're at the TV. The TV. We don't need to do that. Because we just did that. Uh, anything in here? Oh. Okay. So, I, I suspect it is the apartment numbers. Because it said four digits, but there's six. Six you can enter. Um, <clears throat> so I suspect something will tell us what order to put them in. So it's a dude here. Or is he like a little bit random? Let's find out. Oh look, the put the picture's missing. I guess there's a there's a few places you can pick the picture up from. That's interesting. No, it's that room. I'm an idiot. Never mind. Haha. <laughs> what is that noise? Can't get in here. Okay. Hey, Sophia. Yeah, yeah, this is terrifying. It just randomly changes to like survival horror. Perfect place for a black witch to show up. Yeah. We've. Oh, we already had one show up and we killed her. It's quiet. No one could probably hear your scream from here. <laughs> That's really good to know. Thank you for that information. Uh, no, 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 she's not back, but we, we killed her. We killed her already. Okay, so what room is this? Was this a room we care about? I don't think it was. Found a meat mallet. What the hell is a meat mallet? A tool used in kitchens that make up for one brutal weapon. Swinging this will, will surely score you critical hits every now and then. Oh, that sounds right. Wait, were you not here for that fight? In the in the God Realm, uh, in the basement of the church, that was where we lost Marinara. This is, it's about the same, isn't it? Uh, ba, 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 ba. So I, I, I guess this is slash, which can, which is better for removing limbs, but it doesn't crit. Yeah, her X, XGF. She was like a, a black witch, and a contestant too. So we actually killed a contestant. Do people die dying this? Oh yeah, absolutely. Um, including you frequently. You know what? You can keep the spear, Olivia. You get the mallet. The funny black witch from... Oh, that one. Okay. Yeah, this would be a good place for that, wouldn't it? <clears throat> what room is this? This is room eight, and we don't care about eight. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Don't come in. You're not welcome in here. Nope, nope. You son of a bitch, go away, 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 go away. Run, 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 God damn it, why was I stuck? Why was I stuck? Oh god, what the fuck is this? Why is it shirt on backwards? Why is it called a neighbor? God damn it, god damn it, this thing's creeping me out massively. Okay, 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 okay. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Uh, your friendly neighborhood neighbor. Yeah, it is. Hey, Psychic, how you doing? This is already more scary than that Hello Neighbor game, isn't it? So in the video, the dev actually takes a picture of a real shirt for Amazon and uses it as reference. Oh, that's interesting. 
Um, what can we do this thing? Left leg, left arm, torso, head, arm. I kind of don't want to fight this thing. But we will. We'll fight it. We'll see. We'll see what, what what makes it tick. Let's go. Go for the arms first. Miss. What? Sack smash. That's a lot of damage. The neighbor whips his tongue out. It seems to be smelling the air with it. Oh my god, that's so creepy. Oh. This is the spookiest game and a significant bit that I played. Yeah, it is. It is legitimately a scary game. Now we attack its head. Can we attack its tongue individually? No, just its head. Okay, let's go. We will actually rev up first and we'll, we'll do a little bit more damage on its head. This might be similar to the salmon snake. Hey! Ha! Huh. Okay, so you just need to survive the one turn, wait for its tongue to come out, and then stab it. Boom. Nice. We figured it out. Awesome. That's that was actually pretty easy. Monstrosity is down. We beat it because fuck you. Each kick gives you satisfaction. Yeah. <laughs> it might be a case where um, it just gets up again. Because that does happen in the city. Okay, so what's this? Uh, 13 is the box room. Box room okay no I would rather not see him again um, but he's not too hard so if we do see him again I'm not that worried because we just guard the first turn wait for him to sniff and then stab him in the face easy uh, small keys are actually pretty useful so I'm, I'm kind of happy I got that <clears throat> yeah the, the narrow hole did make it kind of creepy. Moldy bed here. <laughs> I love this message. No. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. There's not a lot of loot in this place because it's all covered in mold. Oh, hello. A horse head statue stands proudly here. The statue doesn't seem too heavy. You could push it pretty easily. No, leave it. What's going on here? What's going on here? Um, what's different? What's different? Is there something different in this? Um, no, it doesn't look different. Push it this way. Okay, so which which one does it have to be on? Do you reckon? Okay, we'll have to come back to that puzzle. Telescope seems to be carefully positioned here, but you cannot tell where it points because the window is covered in white crust. Okay, so we deal with this white crust situation, then we come back, we look at the stars, and we figure out where this has to be. I get ya, I get ya. Okay. Okay, and... Door is written, is locked with a simple lock. There's handwriting on the door that says, Please do not disturb. I'm sorry. But I have to come in. This is the doll room. The doll room. Okay. Dolls. Okay. This is a creepiest fucking doll room. There is a moldy bed here. You can sleep and rest if you wanted to. Do you want to rest in the doll bed? Not to mention that. I wonder if this has a different a different effect. No, we won't. We won't do that because I don't want to just instantly die. I would prefer not to. Okay, um, so how do we figure out the pattern for the lock? And do we deal with this white mold situation? Is this something we can deal with? Good, stay down. Um, I don't know if, yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure what else to do here. Hey, mechanic cat. How you doing, man? Good to see you. What's the time? What's the day and time of day? So the day is uh, the second day of the festival of Termina, um, where reality is breaking down, and the time of day is midday. 
is there anything else we can do? Is there like a clue as to what the order will be? Oh, let me get the mouse out of the way. Hang on. The door doesn't open. It must have additional safety locks inside. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I saw something upstairs. Um, Marinara died. We were fighting her ex-girlfriend. Um, we were fighting her ex-girlfriend and, uh, her ex-girlfriend killed her and then resurrected her as a ghoul, which was fun. Um, my legs were broken at the time. Is there something here? Yep. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. And so I thought I thought the, the, the playthrough was a bust anyway, so I was just gonna like, you know, that's gonna reset after that. And I was just exploring around trying to find a way out of the church basement. Um, but then it turns out, um, we prayed to Sylvian. And Sylvian gave me my legs back, but they didn't give poor Olivia her legs back, which is very funny. So, <laughs> poor Olivia. <laughs> the guy that's just like, no, no, you're not getting your legs back. You're just not. I wouldn't mind one of those cookie books, actually. How did you heal the legs? We prayed to Sylvian. We, we wrote her sigil down. Uh, in a in a prayer circle and then we prayed to her and um, she gave me she fully healed us and gave me my legs back uh it wasn't did we did we masturbate that time I don't remember gave me along to the darkness investigate how far is it but looks to the rough shapes you can see it should be a I hope we're not going to break our legs dropping down. I would rather not do that again. No, 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 no. Okay, good, good, good. What is this? There's a book on the floor with some erratic writing in it. You find the diary of a madman. Let's go. Oh, let's read his diary first. So we know what we're dealing with. Diary of a madman. Diary of a madman. Here we go. I wonder if it's possible to heal her legs as you play as Olivia. I, I wonder, actually. I wonder. That'd be cool. You know, one thing I don't like is that when you get the um, the wheelchair, only Olivia can use the wheelchair. Nobody else can. Even if they had their legs broken. It's like, well, I have a wheelchair. It would be nice to be able to use it on other people, but, you know, no rare book here. No, unfortunately. <clears throat> Most parts of the diary are completely illegible scribblings of a madman, but towards the end, the text becomes more lucid. Dream of the moon, the sign, the city is in upheaval. Fools, they don't know what awaits them. The moon is of no value to me. It is but the mark of a trigger. The time has come, and so has he. As you are my witness, I am ready, my lord. I've gone through this a thousand times in my head. The first blood. The lunatic that raves about the moon and the stars to all days end. The second blood. The foolish braggart who just moved in. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. So first, first, first was moon and stars. Second was just moved in. Third is puppets. Third puppets so that's obviously the dolls puppets fourth and final sacrifice a girl who keeps me up at night the sung bird that utters her last whimpers okay we have the we have the full combination boom here's your order straight in boys using a wheelchair does take a modicum of skill especially the olivia special drift tackle wait 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 uh, that that reminds me is there can you do like a tackle with a wheelchair is that something that can that you can do? Did I did I see something like that, or am I am I just making that up? 
To finish the ritual, I need time. The laundry room works as a perfect hiding place for the sacrificed. I will swear on your name, my lord, our one true leader, the sulf, the sulfurous sun. Oh shit, okay, wait. Is it not the moon doing this? Is it secretly the sun doing this? That's really interesting. Because we've seen we've seen the sulfurous sun uh, be mentioned a few times. Um, I wonder what that means. That's really interesting. Because who is the sun then? Because Ra is the moon. Hmm. Much to think about. I've seen it when fighting her. That's where I've seen it before. Well, we did, she didn't do it when I was fighting her, but that's, that's how I've seen, where I've, I've seen pictures of it, yeah. Um, the heads are in the washing machine. Yeah, yeah. I hope I can trade them to Pocket Cat. Anything else in here? Man with checkered pants. Oh! Oh, he's the doctor. That sigil on the floor. Do you know what it means? Um, no, I don't actually. Figures. I've only seen it once before. Dan, that's his name, yeah. But I have no idea what it represents. Maybe that's the sigil of the sun. I browsed through the raving documents of the man who used to reside here. Most of it was illegible, but from what I did understand, he was preparing a ritual for an older god, deity, or whatever. Wait. The old... The older gods. So we know four older gods. But there could be another one that we don't know yet. Because there's uh, Vitr Vitrushka, uh, Grogoroth, Sylvian, Rur, um, and I guess a god of the sulfurous sun, which might be the one behind all this. Does the god of fear and hunger count as an older god? Because it feels like it was made in the way it's it's sort of like a being that is similar to the older gods, but it was made in the age of the new gods. So it's kind of weird. Because the older gods seem to be like different to the new gods. So if she does count as a new god, okay. Oh, and Olmir. Olmir is an old god. But see, is wait, 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 is Olmir, is he an is he an old god or a new god? Because the new god system was in place before Olmir was around. They explicitly say that. Um But he's more powerful than the new gods. It's interesting. And we know that people can manipulate the power that creates new gods differently because that's what um um, 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 that's what the sexy man from the first game did. Enki, that's what Enki did. He, he used the power to, uh, uh, to extend his lifespan without elevating to become a new god. So he doesn't paint a target on his back. Old gods have lineage, new gods are, are ascended. Yeah, it's very similar to that. But then you've got, then you have the third tier, which is perfected beings. And that's really, I think that's sort of introduced in this game is the third group, the perfected beings. And that hasn't really been elaborated on much. Man, the lore in this game is so cool. <laughs> like the sigil, this ritual too is something I've seen once before. But no idea what it all means. I wonder if the ritual was complete or not. Or have you seen this before? I want to know more about this ritual. You shouldn't ask things you don't want the answer for. No, I do want the answer for it. It's not really a cheery topic, so let's save it for some other time. Dot, dot, dot. No use moping around. I could have use of it. Oh, hell yeah! Yeah! Um. Sure. Great. We don't really know each other, do we? I'm Dan. Fuck yeah! What sigil is that? Yeah, I haven't seen that before either. Dan looks so cool. This building, something feels very off about this place. 
What is this mold? It's covering everything. I'm not sure if it's actually mold. The texture is unlike anything I've seen. Rubbery and crusty at the same time. Yes. Interesting. Um, no, no, I didn't go to the uh, the eastern part of town. I didn't go there for ages. So, yeah, I just missed Dan completely. Okay, so the symbol is the alchemical sign for sulfur. Ah, so it is the sigil of the sulfurous sun. And I, yeah, like, like I said before, I do believe that's a god that we haven't been introduced to. Okay. Oh, wait, let's, let's kid him out. Let's kid him out since he's coming with us. Um, let's go optimize. No, you don't get the, you don't get the trench gun. Okay. Sharp scalpel. It's very short, but accurate in experienced hands. Okay. Do, do I have any accessories for him? I don't. He has a bit of magic defense, doesn't he? Um, we're not really dealing with magic. So you can just have... Yeah, you can just have that combat jacket. Oh, we're hungry. Um, let's eat. Let's eat. Can I craft anything? No. Food. We're actually kind of getting low on food, hey? Food. You can have mushroom stew. Nice. I might, uh, if we can trade these heads to uh, Pocket Cat, I might buy food books. <laughs> Okay. Um, wait, did it just set it? Or did I do that? No, I did that. Okay. First was the moon and stars. I don't know what that was. Second just moved in. So that's the box room. So second is 13. Um, third is the puppets. So that's 11. Fourth was music. Which was 6. So 2, 13, 11, 6. Two, thirteen, eleven, six. No. Hang on, what? First was moon and stars. Second just moved in. The third was. Let's see this book. Where's Levi's addiction? Oh, yeah, Sylvian must have gotten rid of it. That's awesome. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> Base Sylvian, let's go. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba, books. Diary of a Madman. Let's double check. Let's double check. Dream of the moon, the sign, the city of his upheaval. Fools, I don't know what awaits them. The moon is of no value. It is but the mark of a trigger. Time has come, and so, and so have I. I read it, my lord. I've gone through this a thousand times in my head. First blood, the lunatic that raves about the moon and the stars to all days end. Second blood, foolish braggart who just moved in. So that should be the box room, which is room 13. Third blood, his puppets will bear witness to his bloodletting, which again is the dull room, so that should be 11. And the fourth blood and final sacrifice, a girl who keeps me up at night, the songbird, which is obviously the music room. Hmm. Okay, so All right, all right, all right. Let's go check the Let's go check the rooms again. Maybe I maybe I fucked it up. He's a doctor, isn't the scalpel good for him? Um I think probably, but um But the axis deals so much more damage. Oh, not that much more damage, actually. Now you mention it. Well, position one should just be two. And it, it didn't it didn't trigger. So it should be two, thirteen, eleven, six. Because those, those are the rooms. Alright, let's... 
Unless maybe it changes. Maybe it's random. We'll see. So let's watch this again. Hey, Karen. It did change. <laughs> it did change. <laughs> there you go. Six, nine, eleven, thirteen. Did it change? Actually, Marla typed it out. Maybe I just typed it in wrong. No, it did change, yeah. There you go. That's that's tricky. That's very tricky. You got me. Okay. Well, since all the numbers but one are the same, we can we can go brute force out. I thought it was odd mentioning the moon and stars when the first room you went into didn't have the uh, the telescope, and the other one did. And I imagine that would have been room um, nine, so... So it should be 9, 13, 11, 6. Ding, there we go. Washing machine standing here. Open it, thank you. And let's, oh God. Inside are bloody and disgusting. Upon further investigation, you notice that the washing machine turns into a tunnel. Oh God, okay. Well, this is the only one we're getting out, so. Oh god. Mysterious hole. Too dark to see. Uh, no, no. No, no. No, no. Oh! Oh, this is the god realm. The killer actually did open a hole to the god realm. Interesting. Very interesting. So he wasn't crazy. Well, he was crazy, but he wasn't wrong. Yeah, it is. It is the workshop. What? What is that noise? Oh god. Oh god. called scaring the ever-loving shit out of me is what it's called. Oh man, you get a cube. No, I don't wanna... Uh, oh, it's this guy. Oh, you're easy. Let's go. Ugh, can you not make such disgusting noises, please? Jesus. So we guard the first turn. And we'll probably take a little damage. That's okay. Not much, not much. Now we rev up and we wail the absolute fuck out of his head. Okay. No, don't you miss, don't you miss, you son of a bitch. Ah! Holy crap. Okay, so we just got lucky last time. We got lucky and we hit his head when we probably shouldn't have. Floppy arm is tensing up. We will guard, guard, guard. This is awful. This is really awful. I don't like this at all. I really don't like this. Um, okay. So let's take out... You take out his arm. You also attack his arm. And you get his leg. Jesus. So, 
The first time we fought the neighbor, we got very, very lucky. And now we're all the way back here. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, okay, okay, we'll do that again. We can speed through it. Um, we can speed through it. I might take a short break, actually. I might take a short break. Because we've been going for almost two hours now, so it's a good time for a break. <clears throat> Okay. Oh. Don't you touch that dial. We'll be right back. Uh, and we'll play and we'll get through. We'll get through the nightmare apartment with the fucking boss that is annoyingly difficult. So yeah, BRB. Uh, yeah. Have fun.
Hey, how we doing? I'm back. Oh, uh, uh, um. Okay, I hope you're all well rested from our short break. So I haven't really talked about this publicly much. And I'm not going to talk about it publicly much for a while, but um, I am in the process of redesigning, redesigning uh, what I look like. Um, let me just break break kayfabe for a minute here. Um, it just reminded me because I'm looking at the character designs in Fear and Hunger, and it just it just it's just a fantastic style. It's just a fantastic style, right? Could you imagine a VTuber designed by this artist? Look like Pocket Cat. Oh God, no. <laughs> no. No, I'm not going to be Pocket Cat. <laughs> I'll be, uh, yeah, I'll be, a, I'll, be a, I'll be a cute kitty VTuber. A handsome, a handsome, mysterious cat boy VTuber. Um, uh, I know somebody who has spoken to the artist about doing VTuber designs, but the artist has always been too busy. Or Orange, the dev. He's a, he's a developer of the game too, I believe. I'm pretty sure he does almost everything. Um, 
I don't know if you'll hear. <laughs> I, should, I should have a chat to him about it. Because uh, that'd be awesome. That'd be fantastic. Um, but in order to do that, I need to figure out exactly what I want to do first. And that's why I'm not going to, you know, I'm not going to announce anything soon about a new design because I still have no idea what I want. Um, uh, but yeah, I was just looking at these pictures and I'm like, man. That'd be awesome. <laughs> it's such a cool style. It's so good. I love this artist, uh, Orange. She's so good. I don't know. I don't know if this art style being so unique and, and good is important for the game being so cool. Like, if, if you change the art style... Uh, maybe like maybe like generic anime, right? Put it, throw a generic anime art style in there. I don't know how much it would lessen the impact of the game and make it less cool, but I do know that this art style is cool as fuck, and I am glad it is so unique. Yeah, I think I think you're right there, Headless. It, it adds a lot, but it, it's not vital. It doesn't make the game as cool as it is. It just really helps. It's like it's like excellent sauce on top, right? Food analogy time. It's not. It's gravy. the The meal is already delicious, but then you add this delicious gravy on top, and it's like, yes, perfect. You can't stop me from making food analogies. I'm gonna keep doing it. Games. Uh, a partially a visual medium. I think, I think you could make a game. Oh yeah. Like, like I'm not saying that like, like, yeah, I'm saying that like, yeah, it, it does add a lot to it, but if you change it to like a generic anime style, but still had it as gory, like still, like still the exact same content, just a different style. I think the game would still work. It just wouldn't be as nice. Instead of being a solid 8.5 out of 10, it would it would merely be like a 7 out of 10. <sighs> anyway. Um, combination of all the parts. Yeah, yeah. The fact that yellow mages can do what they do, that a lapse in concentration or faulty judgment dooms you is amazing. It is, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's like if you spend a little bit too long near Osar when he told you to fuck off, that's it. You just, you just dead. <laughs> Watching a TV talk about how good gravy and food is is unsettling. <laughs> Look, I have a real body, okay? I'm just transmitting through a TV. I'm not, I'm not a TV. I'm not a TV head VTuber. We already have a TV head VTuber who like simply is so good I can't compete with them. Um, so I'm not even gonna try. I'm just transmitting through this. Had that in Corpse Party. That's true, yeah. I, I never played Corpse Party, but it's like a super like edgy, over the top gory gory game, isn't it? I suspect it doesn't have the I mean, you know, it's it's one of those things where it's like if something is using a generic anime art style the chances are it it hasn't put as much thought into all the cool lore and things like that like this game has. So this art style being so unique and so good is a green flag that the rest of the game has had as much effort put into it. So when you look at this game and think, man, that's a unique visual style, this game's probably really unique, and yet, yeah, it is. With a generic art style, the game is going to feel a lot more generic. Anyway, anyway, let's um, let's get back to it. What were we doing? What were we doing? Did we re? We I think we reset. Yeah, that's right. We got <laughs> we got licked to death by the neighbor. <laughs> God damn it. Um. So we need to. To get back into the apartment building, we need to get Dan again. 
We need to get the Madman's book again, just in case. We'll get that with Dan. We don't really need to check the rooms. Because we, we've, we've basically got all the important rooms written down, and if there's one missing, we can just guess it. Um, what else? What else? What else? Yeah, that, that should be good. We'll, do, we'll do, go do that. Go do that. Can you imagine those stress toys of the neighbor? His long tongue comes out. <laughs> yeah, that'd be good. He's, although, um, canonically, he does stink. He stinks and he's covered in shit. So I don't... No, we don't go that way. Dan's that way. Osa is that way. Should we try and trigger Osa? No. Go away, Bobby. I don't care. I'm not dealing with you today. I don't have time for the police. I don't have my walking license and you can get fucked. I'm edgy like that. And you, sir, do not shoot me. I am not in the mood. I said don't. I said don't. God damn it. Don't shoot me, you bastard. Can we pick up his head, actually, while we're here? No. You're close to the save point. Which save point? Oh, no, no, no. So by, by trigger Osar, what I meant was there's another scene you can do with him. Um, but it's a long scene and I don't feel like doing it. Oh, I had to go through this again, don't we? Oh, this is the worst part. It's cool talking to Pocket Cat, but I don't want to do it 10 times. Oh yeah, okay, let's see if we can, let's see if we can trigger the fight. Um, how would we do that? You're mistaking me for someone else. Things should have changed since then, haven't they? He just ignores you. <laughs> That's funny as. Yes. Uh, maybe I can't be bothered with this. Oh, pardon me. I'm sorry if I took your time. I don't mean to delay you any further. From personal experience. I say, it's, <laughs> you keep talking anyway. <laughs> Um Yeah, I don't I don't think we can fight him here. Yeah, no, he just You can't actually piss him off. That's how chill this dude is. He seems so nice. He he does seem nice. Um he's not the sort of guy you want to be alone in the room with. That's for sure. Um if I didn't have a weapon, I wouldn't speak to him. I'm going to try something different. I, uh, if we go into the um, the hotel, the apartments, uh, we might end up getting fucked. So I don't feel like doing that right now. He goes to the tower. Revelin Feces, uh, base department. Ah, oh, damn it. Just because the neighbor is out of his natural environment, he needs to slither around in mud and less filth. Yeah, maybe. This game really does know how to ratchet up the pressure. this way. Shopping district, church of Ormere, business district, Domex of Orphanage. Okay. 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 Charming. Mind finding somewhere to save. Oh, can you go away, please? I don't want to deal with you, Needles. I really don't. Oh, hello. 
There is a person tightly wrapped in barbed wire. The barbed wire seems to be coated in some kind of murky liquid. Do I want to touch the gross barbed wire? Person has been dead for a while. Let's take some. Find a thorned ring. Oh. Um, what does that do? A ring with thorns that emits a steady flow of poison to its wearer. Steady flow makes one immune to more potent toxins. Okay. Hmm. Maybe there's some fights where you get... They keep, like, nuking you with... With heavy poison, so that would be useful there. But... That's not the sort of ring you just generally wear around, is it? Delta Rune reference. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> what is that? What is that? No, I'm good. Let's go. <sighs> no, I'm not talking to it. I don't care. I'm not. It's not a friend. No, it's not an umbrella. Oh, an interesting looking statue. It reads for fertility and prosperity. Is this a Sylvian? A Sylvian, uh, a Sylvian pyre where they sacrifice people. Probably, yeah. I don't want to. I don't want to be there when they do that. So, ah, go away, 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 go away. You cheeky bastard! What's up here? What's up here? Please don't dead end. Please don't dead end. It dead ends. He stopped. He stopped. He stopped. He ran out of breath. Good. 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 Ugh. Ugh. Well, it is in public. And, you know, we've got at least two dicks on there. So, you know, it's as classy as Sylvian's ever going to get, right? The ruination of this area seems somewhat recent. Oh, that's interesting. Booby trap. Can we... Actually, can we booby trap? That is another booby trap. Oh, what is that? 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 Whoa! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's the mob. It's the mob. It's the mob. It's the mob. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> Sylvian monstrosities. Uh, dicks out for Harambe. Half cocooned. Meat grinder and rifleman. Um, all of these look like they can fuck me up, so whatever. Try to run, please. Thank you. Can we? So, because there's three people there. When you leave battle, only the one you were fighting is paused. But because there's three of them that all trigger the same fight, I think I'm just going to have to fight them and just die. So... Alright, um, which one's gonna fuck me up the most? Meat Grinder looks pretty bad, so let's... Let's attack him first. Well, I was right that Meat Grinder is the worst. Okay. Um, they don't. If you leave a fight, all the other ones are unpaused. Okay. So. Uh, don't get caught by the mob under any circumstances. It seems like you need a full party to deal with the mob. Or some ridiculously good weapons. Because we didn't even scratch that guy. Well, okay. That was not a fun time.
Okay, so what we'll do is we'll go back to the we'll go back to the apartments. We'll do that because I we, we know, I know how to do that. So we'll do that. We'll get we'll get that done because we'll pick up the extra party member and get another effigy. So skill skill yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, skill issue. I got myself pinned. It was my own fault. Don't get yourself backed into a corner. That's incredibly fatal in this game. That's what screwed me over in the first place when I broke my legs. Oh, we have Pocket Cat. God damn it. I'm going to go save after this. I'm going to go save after Pocket Cat. No, wait. No, I know what to do. I know what to do. Okay. So, what we're going to do is, we're going to go up there, and we're going to um, 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 do this conversation. Oh, he's not here. Did I already do that? I must have already done it. Maybe I did do it on this playthrough. It's it's sort of hard to know the exact stuff you've done. Uh, but I don't know if I saved after that or if I died. Because I'm pretty sure I died a few times in the church. Anyway, I, I suspect getting um, Osar to join your party, the Yellow Mage, to join your party is insane, insanely tough to do without just starting as him. So I don't think we'll be able to figure it out anyway. <laughs> so I'm not, I'm not too worried. I'm not that worried. Yes, 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 yes. I'm going to be a sneaky boy. And let's go up here. And I want this, and I want this, and I want lucky coin. We'll scoot back up here. And we're not fighting that guy because I don't have a death wish. It's interesting that. The people, there's, uh, what is it, 12, 14 festival members? And they're not the biggest badasses running around town. But there's people, like that guy down there, could just go through and just kill every one of the festival members if he wanted to. Except maybe Osar. Okay. Okay. Let's go. How the hell are we going to try and kill a bloody... <laughs> a bloody yellow mage who's sane. Osai is sane. The other yellow mages in the first game were, were insane and they were hard enough. Okay, so we'll do that. Um, we will go and trigger Pocket Cat and get this conversation out of the way. Then, I will find a spot to save. Um, he is at the moment. Um, I, you know, that will probably change. This is the, the night of the festival, so... I don't know if these answers actually mean, mean any different, make any difference, right? Because he doesn't seem to have any different responses afterwards. <laughs> Where is the closest save point, I wonder? Maybe down in the village. Yeah, actually, there's one right outside the gates. So I can do that.
yeah, right now he's saying, he's just like, don't, don't come near me. Do not come near me. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, actually, there is some stuff I wanted to grab in here. So that's fine. Because now we should have a key. And we should be able to get in. Wait. Give me some wine. Yeah. Do I have a key? Yep. Nice. Really good stuff in here. Thank you. Another lucky coin. Two lucky coins up. Let's go. Nice, 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 nice. Awesome. All right. Okay. We got all the wine. Got all the stuff. Got two extra lucky coins. Very happy. Very happy. And needles his bucket off. So, oh wait, can I cut his head off now? Oh, there it is. Saw off his head. Oh, that's an awful noise. That's an awful noise. Okay. Can I cut your head off? Okay, so there should be... Is it in here? I'm trying to remember where that... Oh, I want to kill you anyway if I'm going to sleep in here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Rusty pipe, nice. The cellar. So we should get the cellar. Is there a bed down here? Oh, hello. Oh, we can save here. Um, will I want anything else? No, I think we'll save. I think we're to save. Uh, is there anything else I want to do before I save? Um, shillings. I should go buy some stuff. Should go buy some stuff. Uh, per per statue, yeah, yeah. Um, but you can also sleep, and I kind of want to sleep so I can level up. But I'm not too worried about that. Okay, so I'll go buy some stuff, and then I'll come back here and save. Sorry, this is taking a little bit of time, but you know how specific this game is, right? <laughs> Oh, can I cut this dude's head off? Vile head. Nice. Where are the heads kept? Oh no, they'll be in body bag. You couldn't get the mask off. Oh, that's unfortunate. Marco's head. The severed head of Marco. Goat hoof. It's still relatively fresh. Can I eat that? Oh shit, you can. I'm not going to do that though. <laughs> okay. okay, so let's just get... No! Shit! What? Matches? God damn it. That's so fucking annoying. Ah! I don't know why it defaulted to matches. <sighs> Whatever. Okay. 
Um, 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 um. So. Go here and save. Oh, wait, what's this? No, no. Not getting that. What's in here? A little bit of scab grab. White vial. Nice. Okay. Can you do something with these heads? Somebody said that uh, every head you could trade. Oh, can we take it to the to the guy? Um, can we take it to the guy that wants that wants the the huntsman's head? Yeah, can can I can I take it to the guy that wants the huntsman's head? Can can we do that? Because I might do that before saving. <clears throat> He's only a collector of specific heads. Oh, okay. Well, that's alright. We'll do that some other time. Um, yes. Yes, save. Thank you. Heads have other uses, really. Okay, yeah, yeah, spill it. What, what do I what do I do with the heads? What do I do with them? And should I be collecting more? Because I'm more than happy to cut the heads off things if I need to. For instance, this Bobby's head. Explore the east part of this town. Okay. Your distant laughter. Can I cut this dude's at health? Nope. Okay, east part of the town. I've already been around that way though. Pre-town, pre-heaval. Uh, old town? Do you mean? Old town, pre-heaval? Like, you know what? I might, I might look that up some other time. Um, I don't feel like uh, poking around and exploring too much right now. I want to, I want to do the, I want to do. I want to do the apartments. Oh, small key, sick. I want to get the apart. I wanted to. I wanted to get an ending today, but we're so stuck on these apartments. It's not even funny. <laughs> All right, come on, you gross fucking. Disgusting thing. You two shit hounds. Kill it, kill it. Yes, yes, yes. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Damn. He's gonna friggin' Yeah, infect. Don't infect. Ah, oh, god damn it. No, wait, wait, wait. Attack. Yeah, attack. Yeah, okay. <sighs> okay. Certain enemies I just hate fighting because there's, you just don't get, you, like, you get nothing for it. Except everything is just worse off. Actually, I'm pretty hungry. No? What are you doing? What are you doing? Food. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Ba -ba -ba mushroom stew. You can have that. And you can have penny bun. Well, that, that. Did nothing. <laughs> um, you can have. You miss a meat pie. Here you go. Yep. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Yep, yep, yep. So, first things first, uh, get the master key. Take that. Then we check out the TV to find out what rooms we need to care about. Sippy while we do this. Mr. Sandman, dream me a dream. Make him the cutest. Two, six, eleven, thirteen. Okay. That's the first one, it's two, two, six, two, come on, six, eleven, thirteen, okay. <clears throat> Alright, now we go upstairs and we get the journal. Well, we don't really need the journal, do we? No, not really. Uh, unless the order changes, the order might change. Order may change. Let's just open that in case we get chased. Okay. Hang on, 13. Okay, yep. Yet the rooms actually stay the same themselves, which is good. Yep, I guess it doesn't take too long to go through this process, does it? Could be a lot worse. Could be a lot worse. I think when you play on very hard, on the hard mode, you don't get any saves. That would just be painful. Okay. And we pick up... That. Can we sleep here? No. Oh god. Hard symbol. Uh, hard solo mode would just be insane. Hard solo genocide. Let's go. <laughs> I don't know if there's like explicitly solo mode in this. Uh, could this ritual be the chaos source of the chaos in the city? Don't know. I doubt it. I'm not a superstitious person. How can you not be after what you're seeing here? That's a very good question. There's some wild things out there wandering the streets, sure. But there is always a scientific answer to everything. Whether that science exceeds the science of today is another topic entirely. But it's always something you can study and learn. No use moping around. I could have use for some company. Would you mind if I joined your party? Absolutely. Doing a um, a genocide one. People have, I mean, you know, people have already done. You know, kill everyone runs day one, complete the game. They've already done that, right? You know, you know what people are like. But man, it must be so hard if you don't pick Osar. The neighbor wasn't there. Maybe we just we just accidentally avoided him. I hope I can accidentally avoid the neighbor in the upside down as well. Wait, let's kit him out. Do we have... No. No, 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 no. Um... Slash PS fire, slash PS fire. Okay, about the same. <clears throat> I hope the neighbor doesn't just like own me again. Wait, I need to check the diary, don't I? Madman's, Madman's, Diary of Madman, okay. 
We'll just check if it's the same water. Um, first blood, foolish braggart who just moved in. Okay, so... Um, moved in. It is different. Second blood, one who talks only to her plants. Plants, there we go. That's the one we, we got first time. Third blood, the girl who keeps me up at night. Music. And fourth is puppets. Okay. Puppets. So that is uh, 13. Um, plants is 2. Music is 6. And puppets is 11. Okay. Let's go. So 13. Two, six, and eleven. Too easy. All right. Okay. Let's uh, pray to the god of fear and hunger that we get out of this place. Please, Olmir. Please let me get out of here alive. I don't want to go through this for the umpteenth time. Please, Olmir. If I see a neighbor, I'm just running. I'm not dealing with it. Okay. Oh, I can't run, I can't run, I can't run, I can't run. Okay, 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 okay. The liquids are being drained from her. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, why are there so many? Why are there so many? Uh run, 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 run. My god, my god, my god, my god, my god, my god. Please let me run, please let me run. Ah, oh, why are there like 10 of them? God. Nope, 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 nope. Don't care, not fighting them. Don't care. Ah, Oh, Jesus. What is this place? Don't you do it, 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 don't you do it. You know, these guys aren't very neighborly. Jesus. How the hell do I get out of here? Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Oh, the sulfur sign. Hang on. Hang on, was that, was that called what I thought it was called? The fellatio... <sighs> Never change. Never change, fear and hunger. Okay. No, you can stay closed. How do I get, how do I get out of here? Up? Nope, not up, not up, not up, not up, not up. Nope, 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 nope. <clears throat> what? He was close enough? Oh, okay. Run away, if not attack that, if not attack that. 
Please, 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 yes. Good, go away, go away, go away, go away. How do I get out of here? Oh, here we go, here we go. Nope, 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 nope. Something in here, something in here, no. Hey buddy, you just don't move, thank you. Thank you for staying very still as I walk past. Don't pin me in, thank you. Can I go up? I can't go up, I'll go down. And I can't go down. And I can't go up. Okay. Fuck. Uh, okay, okay, so what do I do? What do I do? Um, I am pinned because I'm an idiot. So, we have to kill this one. We have to kill this one. Um, okay, so now we go to fucking town on his arm. Please break it, please break it, please break it. Why aren't you broken yet? We'll rev up. And we just need to get these arms down. So he stops being an, so fucking annoying. Okay, good. That one's down. Can you stop doing that, please? It's disgusting. Guard, guard, guard. Because you're going to do something gross. Okay, good, 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 good. Back to the washing machine. Oh, maybe, yeah, maybe the uh, the place has opened up now that we've broken the um, broken the curse. Okay, so attack this. Uh, no, you. Olivia can heal. What do we have to heal her? We have blue vial, which isn't bad, but we can do better, I think. Um, I can't do better actually. No. Okay, blue vial it is. Okay, and Dan. Attack the arm as well, please. And next turn, we're going to rev up and we're going to go to town. <sighs> okay. And we're just going to smash him. And you actually attack the back leg, Dan, please. I should break it. Yes, awesome. And she's just going to attack the body and just deal basic damage, and that's good. But if we can break the leg, we didn't break the leg. God damn it. Um, okay, now we focus the leg. Because if I break that, then the head will be a lot easier to take out. Yes, there it is. Oh, awesome. Okay, that wasn't bad. He didn't poke his tongue out, which was interesting. I guess that was just RNG. Medical diagnosis. Oh, yeah, that's right. Dan has that ability. <clears throat> this hulking thing seems to have gone through large-scale transformation. There are signs in its anatomy that this thing was once human. Its skin has become scorched and is hard to puncture. Its arms have gained mass and they now look like more like uh, bags of potatoes. And finally, its head seems to have transformed in a form that emphasizes its mouth and tongue. Very charming indeed. Might not come as a surprise, but there is no known medical ailment that could cause something this big. The body seems to be in a somewhat vulnerable to piercing attacks, as well as otherworldly powers. So that's the spear going to town on that is piercing, I believe. Um, I wonder if the scalpel counts as piercing. Find a small key. Don't mind if I do. Saw off its head. I hate that noise. I hate that noise so much. Okay. So yeah, let's go back to the washing machine. What's this? Nothing. Because perhaps the curse is lifted and we can run. Attack its leg. Attack its leg. Okay. Good, we got out, we got out, we got out. And we can do a sneaky and dodge around it. The neighbors look like anteaters. Which makes sense that they're draining the fluids of their victims, right? Wait, what's down here? 
Oh, is this how we- Oh, this is actually how we came in. Okay. Perfecto. Perfecto. Okay. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah, perfect. Okay, let's get the fuck out of this place and never, ever come back. I'm done. Just nuke preheval. I'm done. With me in it. That's fine. Is something going to jump us before we get out? Maybe. God, I hope the mob doesn't spawn. Please don't spawn. Please don't spawn. Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? We got that one. So now we go... Oh, go away. <laughs> this game just keeps ratcheting the pressure up, doesn't it? You just, you just don't... You don't get a break. <laughs> Please don't spawn up the top. Please don't spawn up the top. Please don't spawn up the top. No, he didn't. Thank God. Okay, please give me a bed or something up here. Please. Ah, uh, this was where we fought the clothes. A big pile of clothes. That feels like so long ago. No, no. No, whatever you're doing, stop it. The club is in a state of standstill, waiting for the horrors to end. This place. I need to do something. You'll find me behind the bar counter. Oh, okay. You think this place is safe? I could really use a break. Oh, 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 perfect. Can I act, can I rest? Looks like I'm your bartender for today. What would you like to have? Could you use a drink? What shall it be? Glass of whiskey. Coming right up. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> Here you go. Glass of old Vinland whiskey. Even before sipping the finely decorated glass, the rich and deep aroma fills your nostrils. You wait for a brief second before taking the first sip. The whiskey gives a small, burning sensation on its way down, but you still savour the, the taste for as long as it lingers on the tip of your tongue. A deep warmth fills your insides long after the glass is empty. You finish the drink. Nice. Hi, it's the evening of the second day already. Worried about the three day time limit? I'd be lying if I said I didn't worry. Considering the horror in the city, it's obvious that something very abnormal is going on here. What happens when the time limit expires? Are we going to turn into madness as well? What is going to happen at the end of three days? Okay, how are things here? The club is nice. I'm not too used to clubs and city life in general, but I've always wanted to experience a place like this. If only it was full of people and full of hustle. I guess I'll only have to imagine it for now. When we get out of here, I'll take you to a club. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Sounds great. Looking forward to it. Maybe you dance as well. <laughs> She's going to die horribly, isn't she? The moon falls. It Honestly, yeah, it probably does. Okay. How are you doing, buddy? To be frank... That sigil has occupied my thoughts for the most part. That ritual, maybe it really has a connection to the events happening in this town too. Just need more answers. I know this bar doesn't really give me any of them, but I decided to wait and see what happens. Whatever this festival of Termina is, it is clearly progressing towards something after all. Okay. Okay. 
did Levi and Dan fully reheal? I get it. We have places to be. I can't be bartending here all day. I haven't been to places like this before. You must think I'm the biggest geek around. Yeah, you are, you fucking nerd. <laughs> nah, she's sweet. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna try something. Here's what I wanna do. I think that having that drink fully rehealed me. So. Um, oops, wrong, wrong one. Ah! Wrong one, wrong, wrong one. No, stop it! God damn it, god damn it, god damn it. Okay. Tag along. Cool, okay. I could use a drink, what shall it be? An old fashioned. Nice choice, my speciality. Here you go. You rock the ice around the glass a few times. The old fashioned settles down and you catch a scent that is both a mix of sweet and musky. You taste the drink briefly to check out the exact ratio of its ingredients. The whiskey, which seems to be on the more expensive side, is clearly the dominating flavor, but the sugar and water help the drink roll off the tongue more easily. You are pleased to notice the herbal taste of the Enga Sutra only hints with its presence afterwards, never trying to rival the key ingredients. It soon becomes evident that this drink is perfectly mixed old-fashioned. It has all the best qualities of a good whiskey, but it's casual enough for you to drink like a sailor. You finish the drink. Dan's a... Okay, no, it didn't heal me. So, well, Olivia didn't get healed. It's... <laughs> I love little character moments like this. Like, like Dan is, as a, as a really accomplished bartender. That's great. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I don't know. I get the impression that Orange just watched a bunch of um, bartending anime, of which there is an explicably large amount. Okay, so let's 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 go back to Old Town. And you said that there was a book of enlightenment in Old Town. I would like to go pick that up and save because I don't want to have to go through that again. As much as I enjoyed going through the apartments, I don't want to have to do that again like for like a third time. Oh shit, oh shit, what is that? What is that? What is that? Ah no 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 Okay What was that? Jesus Uh Um <laughs> of course, of course. Oh, why did I expect anything different? Why did I think that an area that I'd gone through 10 times that was perfectly safe before would continue being perfectly safe? Did I forget I was playing Fear and Hunger? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I got comfortable. I got comfortable. It's my own fault. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, man. <laughs> Let's get the shit out of me. Hundred <laughs> percent on me. Hundred percent. What did I expect? <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh man. You can never, you can never relax in this game. Never. Not even for a second. <laughs> 
Yeah, I'm I'm a piss baby right now. I've completely ruined these pants. The amount of times I piss them while playing this game is like double digits at least. Double digits, easy. Okay, so go east after the stairs in Old Town. You'll find the entrance. Um, the stairs in Old Town. Wait, hang on. Go east after the stairs in Old Town. You'll feel the entrance. Okay. Okay, I get you. I get you. Now, needles, please don't spawn. Thank you, needles. Thank you for not spawning. I really appreciate that. Okay, so go east. Give me blue bar. Thank you. Three shillings. Is there anything I want to buy? Not really. Not really. Okay, so we go east. In Old Town. And we need to go through there again, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, I think we do. Oh, hello. Don't mind if I do. White vial. Eh, not super useful. Okay. <clears throat> I will be taking your head. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Wait, can we offer heads? Uh, actually, no, I don't want to. I don't want to offer anything to the new guys anyway. Oh, wait here. Offer the portrait of a young man. Oh, uh, okay. Put the offering in the center of the circle. The air cools down and becomes thicker. It feels heavy just to breathe. The radiating one. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> what have I done? What have I done now? What is this? Okay. Okay, this is interesting. Because... Um, uh, Maranara's girlfriend, when she transformed, she was talking about being radiating. And she was obsessed, um, her name was Dysmorphia, so obviously body dysmorphia, where she was unhappy with her body. And this guy is straight up saying, embrace your flaws, embrace your imperfection, embrace distortion. So she's linked to this guy. Whatever the fuck this is. Wait. Why did you even summon me? What the hell? How troublesome. Who gave you people the ability to summon us at a whim anyway? Don't bother me again if you got no goods. Okay. No, I want to keep the contestant heads. But I will sacrifice all non-contestant heads. The tainted one rises slowly from the pool of blood. Oh, Jesus. Unbearable existence, the suffering, the agony. We play the secret song that echoes from within. The sound is like razors through flesh. Can you hear it? Yes, you can hear my voice after all. You, who came with the offering. Ask and thou shalt receive. You receive seven soul stone shards. Nice. Oh, explorer of the further regions. Farewell. Explorer of the further regions. Uh, it's a straight Hell Hellraiser reference. Okay. Look, 
occult grimoires. Nah, yeah, that, that one always drops. This bookshelf always drops occult grimoires. Um. Okay, so what the fuck do I do with the soulstone shards? Maybe you have more of these. How many more? Can I like craft it? Ah, yes I can. Nice, okay. Mixed herbs, we want blue mixed herbs. That's very good. We don't want to mix a white vial. Okay. Uh, okay, so are these full soul stones? Like you don't you don't have to charge the soul stones in this one, do you? Wherever the hell it is. So I just need to find a bed so I can go and spend these. Um, and then we'll be up to the last day and we will be very tight on time. Okay, so what are we doing? What are we doing? You need to find a bed to sleep in so that we can spend the soul stone points. Yeah. And then it will be, it might actually be the, the dawn of the third day, 24 hours remaining. Um, in which case we'll have to haul ass after that. Did I kill this chick? Did I kill her? Where is she? Maybe I did kill her. Or maybe they just wander off after a while. Because there's like three guys in here. And only one corpse. Yeah, they must have just walked off. Okay. That's alright. Don't really care. So what the hell do you offer the Radiant one? What does he want? Ah, corpse. I'll take that. A radiator. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, you know. <laughs> Why not? Um, okay, okay, okay. So there should be a bed in here. No? There's, there's a house around here that's supposed to have a bed in it. Maybe that's in the other, the other part of Old Town. Oh, maybe it's upstairs. Surely there's a bed upstairs. Oh, no, but there is a chest. Oh, sick. What do we get? Pet pills. Let's go. Can I have a bed, please? Dan is starting to feel hungry. You're not hungry. Quiet. Is there seriously no bed up here? Evil old town. Maybe it's in here. Maybe it's in here. No, that's the shitter. Um. What the hell? Where is this bed? Am I just being an idiot? Am I just like a completely... completely misremembering this entirely. Um, 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 bed, 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 bed. There is one in Old Town. 
But if it's going to be a pain to get back to... Let's go back to the train. That's safe. Oh, can we pry this open? No. Nope. So I want to sleep safely. I'd rather not be attacked while sleeping. Oh, hello. Gross. Gross. Can I, oh, can I take this, dude, Ted? sleep in here because the woodsman's dead it shouldn't be an issue fingers crossed you know <laughs> maybe <laughs> I guess we're about to find out okay. yes nice come on Percocet oh shit why am I dead? Why does it say I'm dead? I'm not dead! <laughs> the one under the pale hue of the moon god. How may I aid you in your quest? Okay. So. How do we use this thing? I, I don't know how to do this. Gun proficiency? I don't even use guns. Gunslinger. Marksmanship. Because there's no ammo. There's no ammo. On guard. Order charge. Agility. Attack, defense, magic defense, magic attack. What's this? Blood sacrifice, masturbation, engrave. Sounds very useful, actually. Hmm. So, what um, skills are sort of recommended? Man, Bob and Weave was so bad. I used it. I played it with it on uh, the Thug on my first playthrough, and it worked like once. It was insane how bad it was. Right. Agility. Flesh puppetry. Mastery over vermin. Mischief of rats. Counter stance. Adrenaline rush. Fast stance. Uh, see, I see. I like the idea of engrave because I know you can engrave sigils on people. But... I don't know if it's something that's like super complicated to do or not. Um, persuade, lockpicking, escape plan, diplomacy, war cry, bloodlust, devour, sisu. Australian? Um, no. What gave you that idea? Summons, spice, dodge, and stats. Do I have any summons? Advanced Botanism. They're both called Advanced Botanism. Hurting. Oh, I kind of want hurting. I kind of want hurting. That's a big investment, though. Necromancy. Engrave is just a simple menu once you have... Oh, sick, I'm taking that then. Can I not take it? Do I have to take blood sacrifice first? How does this even work? How does this even work? <laughs> Bury the trauma on guard orders charge. I, I, I honestly have no idea how any of this works. Blood sword. Pheromones. Right. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I think you get these based on your how how much uh, affinity you build with with the god, and we've built a lot of affinity with the god of fear and hunger, so we can do them. Why can't I do these, though? 
Because these are like the basic ones. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I kind of want that, but... Um... <sighs> hmm... See, I don't use guns because the ammo is just so rare. Maybe, 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 maybe. Blood sword. That sounds really cool. Inver I really want to know what the inverse crown of thorns is. It sounds so cool. Well, agility would be pretty useful though, because that gives you dodge, doesn't it? And and just speed. So I might put start putting points into uh, fear and hunger, because I can do this. Mastery over vermin isn't going to be super useful, I think, but the agility would be. And flesh puppetry. I can't even take bear of the trauma. It's so weird that there's all these abilities that you're just like, nope, nope. Gun proficiency. I can't get any more shotgun shells. Shotgun was a bad pick for a gun for him. Shotgun's a really bad pick because you just don't get any ammo for it. And you can't buy it either. So... Uh, not... It, it's kind of a first run. Um, I haven't finished the game yet, but this is like my second character. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna put points into fear and hunger. Oh, oh, that's useful. We can tell other people to learn it. Okay. Um. Hmm. Well, Levi. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll put it on Levi anyway. Go flesh puppetry. How does flesh puppetry work in this? I wonder. Okay, mastery over vermin. Do we want to talk to rats? God, yes, I want to talk to rats. Cool. And we will. Let's talk to him. There are nine souls left. And so, the fourteen are no more. Splendid. The time is running. Do not lull yourself to comfort. You have a job to do. Head to the tower. Let the blood spill. As fourteen is reduced to one, so opens the gates to the court of Rur. Okay. Let's save over... Okay, okay. Okay, so skills. Rot. Requires one rev point. What the hell is a rev point? What is this? <laughs> Gain ability to talk to those who are often left unseen. Yeah, I, I know, I just don't want I just don't want to have that many saves. So what is his agility is at 11. That's pretty kind of low anyway. Aren't rev points gained when you get hit? Oh, right. Rev up. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, rev up. You get a rev up each turn. Okay. So you can't, that means you just can't instantly cast right on the first turn. Did I go down here? That's a Grogoroth sigil, isn't it? Do I not have Grogoroth? No, it's not Grogoroth, because I have Grogoroth. It's definitely not Ormir. Who is that? Ra. 
Ruh. Okay. Can you get the Ruh symbol? The sigil? I will... Hang on, can you teleport in this one? Like you could in the first game? Mix tabs, wine vial. Okay. You can, but with the perfect sigil. Well, I definitely don't have that. Um, I will leave this here. I'll write it down that I have this. We have we have an extra old gods sigil in the woodsman's basement, so that's useful. That's useful to know. We can do something with that later. Maybe a save point. Do the other gods' sigils do anything? Like the fear and hunger, like... No, not helping me. Still not helping me, you bastard. Oh wait, can we just pick up the head, like here? No. <sighs> Olmir on perfect gives a portal, but you have to give up a save from fear and hunger. Really? <laughs> oh, it's the third day, so it's all misty. Okay. Okay, so we're all saved up. We're all good to go. And now we are going to go to, I think it's the orphanage is next. Which I'm sure is going to be a delightful time. Absolutely delightful. What's up here? Uh, I'm gonna flip a coin. Fuck it. Bear trap. Are you kidding me? I wasted a coin for a bear trap? How many shotgun rounds do I have left? I have two. I have two. Great. I have two. Yeah. Don't pick the shotgun. What? Oh, are you kidding? What? He's just standing right there? Oh my god. This is terrifying. Um, okay, so I imagine fire is really strong against this guy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk to him. And Olivia is going to use... Murky Bile. And Dan is going to... Analyze. Beekeeper. Dot, dot, dot. The beekeeper just stares at you with his empty gaze. I mean you no harm. You understand me? Dot, dot, dot. A bee flies in one eye and exits another. Maybe this thing has no brains to begin with. No use trying to talk to him. <laughs> this looks like a job for Dr. Bees! <laughs> Excellent. Oh, 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 don't, 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 don't. Oh, god damn it. Okay, 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 okay. Um... So, what we're going to do is... Um, left leg, right leg, torso, head, right arm. Is he off balance already? He can't be off balance already. We'll attack his legs. No? Arms. The classic. Mm, skills. No, you just photosynthesize. That's really weird that she can do that, but 
That's okay. That's okay. We'll deal with it. Ow, ow, ow. Stop that, please. Ow. Ooh, that really hurt. Analyze him so he's vulnerable. Oh, okay. So that's what that means. Okay, you're going to rev up and you're going to use rot. Yes. And Olivia is going to heal because she is going to get dunked soon. And Dan is going to rev up and take out this dude's arm. I'm kind of glad he's only attacking Levi because Levi's kind of tanky compared to the rest. Rev up, rev up and attack the arm and rev up and attack the arm. I'm sure he's going to do something horrible and awful the moment his arms are broken, but we'll get to that. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Oh, is this why we got the um, the poison ring before coming here? Gonna pull out a Glock. God, he might. <laughs> I'm not fucking around. <laughs> okay. Cut his leg off, cut his leg off. Yeah, it just does not do much damage. Okay, what's what's the gimmick with this fight? Why is he not doing much? What's going to happen? Is he going to explode into a swarm of bees when he dies? Is it going to be like a two-stage fight? Um, rev up. Rev up, rev up. And you are going to attack. He won't be off balance till next turn anyway, no matter what we do. So... Rev up, go to town. Let's go. He could, like, he could just be weak. Huh. Okay. Gross, but okay. Medical diagnosis. This creature. He looks like a mishmash of beehives. Even the insides are completely hollow. Why can't you just befriend them? Um. Well, he won't. He won't talk. He he wouldn't he wouldn't talk back to me. So I have no explanation for this. I mean, it obviously looks human-like otherwise. Saw off its head. Cannot make sense of what is a head and what is this another beehive. That's that's fair. That's fair. Find two nine mil bullets. Cool. And let's reset so Chuckles fucks off. Yeah, maybe it's supposed to be like a poison fight, but the poison just didn't do much anyway. So hmm. who knows? Who the hell knows? What do I have to get rid of poison? Mix herbs? No, I think it's just the white vial. Okay. I think having three characters really helps. Anything less than three, I think I probably would have been in the tight spot there. One character, that would have been an incredibly difficult fight. Okay, where are we going? We're there. So we can go uh, through the alley and to the left. Yes. Okay, let's go this way. Shillings. Okay, good, 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 good. Shopping district up. Business district left. Dolmex orphanage. Northwest. Oh, fuck this place. Um, I don't want to go this way. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? <sighs> I 
That's bullshit. That's total bullshit. God damn it. Oh, we can't escape. Fucking needles. Are you kidding? Yeah, yeah, you know what? I see you there. I'm just going to wait. If not friend, then why friend-shaped? How is he friend-shaped? He's a nightmare clown. <laughs> I think this might I think this might be it. Oh, bear trap. Uh yes, but that only works if he runs out and he might not. Okay. Shh, you're right, I should have put down a bear trap. <laughs> okay, so the trick is to break both of his arms at the same time. No, you know what I can do? You know what I can do? Oh. This is different. The expression on his face becomes more serious all of a sudden. Okay, that's interesting. Run. Attack. Um, attack. Um. Okay, and now we go item. Uh, bear trap. You son of a bitch! You son of a bitch! He fucking dodged it! No, you know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do? Is I'm going to run back around and make a wall of bear traps. Eat shit. Eat shit. Oh, you're going to have one at a time. Is he coming back? Awesome. Get owned. Get fucking owned. You know what I'm going to do? Oh, 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 oh. Needles doesn't seem to care about your shots. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Um, what can we do? What can we do? Is there anything we need to craft before we go into this? Can we get another mixed herbs? No. Um, um, I think... What healing do I have? I've got three blue vials. Two mixed herbs, so that's decent. Okay. Um. What have I done since saving? Nothing really, actually. Just fighting, fighting the beehive. Okay. So I'm going to change Levi's. No. I'm going to keep Levi's gun on him because I want Needles dead. I want this fucker dead. He's dying right now. <laughs> Needles is is dying today. Okay. Um Ow, 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 ow. Mystery injection. What was that? What did that do? What did it do? Okay, you kind of actually need a heal, don't you? You're really low. It could be heroin. It legitimately could be. Okay. 
Okay. Oh! Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> okay, um, rev up. We need to take out this arm now. And you heal. What's your health? No, you get. You get a mixed herbs, buddy. Okay, okay, okay. That did a lot of damage, but it could be worse, could be worse, could be worse. Rev up. Attack. Yeah, I'm only going to heal if they're, like, going to die next turn from RNG. Rev up. Rev up. Rev up. Attack. Take out this arm. Take it out. Yes! Okay, okay, okay. Okay, what kind of crazy bullshit is he going to do now? He's going to do something. What is he going to do? Skills. Rot. Yes, okay. You... Should be fine. You should be fine. You should be fine. Rev up. He's pulling his cock out! Rev up, attack his other foot. Okay, let's go. Tackle? Is that all he's got left? Does he only have tackle left? Guys, guys, this is it. This is it. He only has tackle left. This is awesome. This is good news. How much health does his legs have? I'm going to switch weapons on Levi. Because I don't want to waste any ammo. That's going to that's going to eat up a turn, but that's okay. Olivia, I'm going to heal on because she is pretty low and a tackle could take her down if we're not careful. And I don't want to lose Olivia. Whereas Dan is just going to Attack the legs. Okay, finally, one leg's down. Um, do we want to rev up this turn? Yep, not fuck it, let's go. We're going all in, baby. We're going all in, baby. Wail on this fucking dude's legs. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Eat shit. You bastard needles. Yes. Nice. Let's go. Yes. Yes. He's done. He'll haunt us no more. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <sighs> Medical diagnosis. Let's see. Let's see what the doctor says. His face. It's smeared with makeup and blood. His expression is still frozen in that shit-eating grin despite having gone through a painful death. <laughs> this guy is in top human form, clearly. Under his garb is a muscular body full of scars. Scary. His muscles are still very tense even after his death. Wouldn't want to run into him alone in the dark alley, that's for sure. We have many times and it is as fun as you expect. Because of his strong condition, he doesn't seem to have many weaknesses. Fire always works on his garbs, though. Interesting. That's something to note for future. Uh, fire works well on him. Eat shit. <laughs> this feels especially gratifying kicking his lifeless body. Yes, it does. <laughs> okay. Find three syringes of heroin. It, it was heroin. There you go. What about the elite dude? Oh god, yeah. I don't want to deal with him. At all. Ever. So...
Okay, 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 okay. No, we're not going that way. We're not going that way in case we get pinned. There's only that ring there that isn't super useful. So, the mob is around here somewhere. And we don't want to get pinned. So we don't... Not oh, there it is, 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 there it is. We're not doing that fight. I'm not doing it. Is there a save nearby? That's a good question. Oh shit, we're all bleeding and infected still. So we need to deal with that. <laughs> okay, so... Do I have anything that deals with infected and bleeding? No. But I will use a dirty pillow paper because it's funny. Dirty toilet paper stops bleeding, but it has a chance to infect you. So if you're infected and bleeding, use a dirty toilet paper first. It is disgusting, but it's effective. So we'll use green herb because... Yes, we'll use green herb. Use that, and you're just bleeding, so we want cloth fragment. Nice. Okay, oh, he's really hungry, isn't he? Okay. Um, you have a whole meat pie, buddy. You earned it. You earned it. Um, can I can I get a recipe book, please? I would like a recipe book, please. Okay, so... Can we go north? Yes, we can. We can go north because then we get to the bar. Okay. We're not going to go through Sylvian Square because I don't want to get killed by the mob. The mob seems like it might actually be worse than... Uh, than needles. Because it's just harder to avoid in general. But the, the mob only shows up in specific locations, it seems. Whoa! Oh shit, 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 shit. Let me in, 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 let me in. Okay, okay, okay. Please don't still be out there. Please don't still be out there. No! Fuck! Oh, God damn it! 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 Okay. Let's try and run. Let's try and run. Holy shit. Are you kidding me? So Dan just gets downed in a single hit. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. No, this is fear and hunger. This is fear and hunger. If you get pinned by a mob wielding heavy machinery, Then you sort of had to expect us. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, okay, okay. Die, die! Dot, dot, dot. The rifleman just keeps aiming at you, not paying attention to your words. The mob seems to be unwilling to negotiate. Jesus! 
So I think the way to fight the mob is to target the meat grinder first. In the first turn, everybody wails on him. If you have less than three people, it looks like you just won't survive straight up. Um, unless you get lucky with crits. I wonder if... Did I already spend my points? Yes, I did. Okay. I wonder if the mob comes back. If you kill them. So I kind of want to try that. Try and fight them and just get rid of them. If that's the case, that'd be really useful. I suspect that that won't be the case. Jesus, we're all the way out here, aren't we? Ah, oh, and we have to fight needles again. God damn it. Uh, I got pinned by the mob. And then just utterly destroyed by the mob. Just decimated by them. Rat. Rat, rat, rat. No, rat, come back here. You hear faint sounds coming from the crack in the wall. It is not safe, master. You should leave. Or crawl into a tiny hole. Maybe this will keep you safe. Get a blue bar. Oh, thank you. It is not safe, master. You should leave. Or crawl into a tiny hole. Well, thank you for the blue vial. Rats. We're rats. We are the rats. Rat. Those abilities to talk to, like, uh, critters and vermin and stuff like that are really, really cool, but they're just... In the first game, they, they basically weren't... Nah, 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 I don't feel like fighting him again. But he's not as hard if you weaken him first, it seems. Oh, right, 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 this guy, this guy, this guy, okay. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. what was the best way to deal with this again? We rev up, and we rot, and then Olivia just just attacks, attacks him in the dick, and Dan. And the ability that lets you talk to the goat. Um, oh, that's a good question, actually. I don't know. Ow! Holy shit! What? That was so much damage! <laughs> okay. You definitely need to heal up a bit. And you just attack his arm. We'll just we'll take his arm down first. Can you stop that, please? That's very rude. My goodness. There we go. No more double slap for you, mister. Okay. I don't think that skill will work to talk to the goat because the goat's not vermin, so... Come on. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Enough. Enough. Okay. Hang on, because his head is exposed, can I just attack him now? Let's try that.
Yes, actually. Okay. Yeah, I did feed the goat a couple of couple of carrots. Take his head. You just keep. Take his head as well. Let's go. Let's go. Everyone on the head. <laughs> the floating head. I love that. <laughs> There's a quest line for the goat. Okay. Search. Can I search him? Find nothing. Give me his head, please. Oh, right, right. We couldn't get his head. Okay. Um, everyone's poisoned. <laughs> Do we need to heal? Um, I don't want to use my mixed herbs. They're very valuable. So, there we go. That did basically nothing. Okay. And we heal with green herb? No. White file. Yep. White file, we use that. There we go. Cool. And oh geez, Dan's kinda low too, isn't he? Um let's use this on Dan. Cool. And he also needs a drink. Thank you. Awesome. Um hunger's a bit low. Go. Oh, go away. Let's reset. Let's reset. Nope, 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 nope. Reset, reset. Okay. Last time that happened, the mob appeared instantly after that. That was another one of the uh the guys. And he can just go do whatever the fuck he wants. I'm not chasing him. I don't care. Okay, we're in the shopping district again, finally, after all this time. And we need to go west, north, northwest. We need to get to the orphanage. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. No, go away, you cretin. What's up here? Nothing. Ah! Get out of the way. I don't want to fight you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get juked, nerd. Okay. We haven't been up here before. Oh, hello. Yeah. <laughs> How about a shilling for poor old me? Here you go. How generous of you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How about a shilling for poor old me? How generous of you. How many shillings do I have? Shilling one. I got one shilling left. Here you go. Take it. Got another penny to spare. Sickness before health. I wonder if she actually gives you something. You know, in any other game, it would be like, oh yeah, you give her ten shillings and she'll give you something. But in this game, she might honestly just be taking your money for the fun of it. Eerie silence fills the old cafe. Ten shillings, all right. Oh, blue herb. Oh, shit. 
That was a blue herb. Nice. It's a plastic plant. Yeah, yeah, it's, this isn't it, this isn't a game where you can go in and expect the same things you get from every other game. <sighs> and it's so hard to tell when it's fucking with you and when it isn't. It's so hard to tell. Oh, why? 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 No. God damn it. Screams of torment echo from the heights above. Okay. Jesus, okay. The store offers at least some sense of normalcy of what was. Portable something, all right. This is awful, and I kind of don't want to be here. Bookstore? Herb store? Oh. Oh, hey, buddy. Sorry. What's your name, pal? Levi. Fuck you, Levi. <laughs> Now that the introductions are out of the way, what do you want, stranger? Ten shillings is all you got, huh? What do you want to buy? Oh, wow, he's got some interesting stuff. Um. Okay, he's has some really good stuff. Really expensive, though, but, um. Nice, very nice. Um, never mind, we're done here. Thank you very much for nothing. Uh, downstairs sound quiet. I'm not going to go down there because I, I actually want to buy from him eventually. Didn't do any purloining back there, did you? No, sir. Okay, interesting. Yeah, um, there's not as much stuff to smoke in this game, I've noticed. Like, I don't think I have anything I can smoke. Yeah, no. I've, I haven't picked up anything I can smoke. Oh, we're really hungry. Um, can someone please sell me a recipe book? Please. I kind of want to keep poking around here. Oh, thank you for the clip. I appreciate that. It's really handy. Like I go through my uh, my streams and I, I I like I note down uh, times while I'm playing um, of things that I think that will make good clips. But uh, if you guys make clips during, that's very useful. Chainmail. Hell yeah. Oh, it's only a little bit better than what I've got. All right. I guess I did have some good stuff. So you have leather armor. What do you have? Much better. Nice. Does a nice magic defense. That's right. Okay. Why was there just a chainmail dress in the middle of a fashion store? <laughs> That's funny as. Yes. 
<laughs> oh, there's stairs here. Oh, there you go. Vertigo distorts the view of the lower rooms. You feel dizzy. Uh, this place sounds horrible. It sounds so horrible. Oh my god! What the fuck? Oh, hey, buddy. The dried man is holding something tightly in his fist. Investigate. The dried man looks dead. He's not breathing and looks almost mummified for whatever reason. This beat goes hard. Hit it. You find a leechmonger ring. Oh, that's interesting. A hefty ring forged by the hermit mages at the south who dedicated their lives to the god of the depths hundreds of years ago. The mages were able to infuse the ring with life-draining magic. Now, the wording in this is often not very specific. The lady in the corner, this one. No, I don't think so. No. No, I can't reach her. How about this one? No. No, we, it doesn't look like we can interact with any of them. Has he been flayed? All their skin's been pulled off. Jesus. Nasty. Why did we get that for free? Why did we get that for free? You don't get anything for free in this game. Okay, so yeah, that's what I—that's what I think. It was on like a desiccated corpse. I'm not wearing that ring. I'm not wearing it. Yeah, it could legitimately be permanent bleed, but then when you attack, like you—you like you get, you like get damage back. I'm not—I'm not putting it on. I'm just not doing it. I like the gate from this side. What? What is this? This person has started to cocoon into something. There are severe scorchings around his body and the growth has become thick shell-like crust in some parts. Looks like the metamorphosis is almost halfway done. Only piercing and otherworldly attacks seem to penetrate the shell. Um... Half cocoon. Oh, this is one of the the mob. I'm not. No, I'm not going down there. I'm not going down there. Don't care. If that's where the mob are, that's where I'm not. Cloth fragment. Nice. 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 White vial. Nice. 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 That was a bop. That beat was a bop. Let's save. No, I don't want to save because that will that will make push time forward, and I don't want to do that. Um, 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 um. I'm gonna scab grab for a bit though. Whoa! What are you? 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 Do we have piercing attacks? Do we have piercing attacks? What do you have? Iron spear. Perfect. What do you have? Axe. Is that piercing? It's, it's, it'd be Slash, wouldn't it? Do we have something piercing? I wonder if Sickle would count as piercing. I wish it would say. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. Half Cocoon Man swings his mallet furiously. Jesus, he's got some danglers there, doesn't he? Um, 
Mallet. <laughs> this is mallet number two. Okay. Everyone wail on his nuts. Ooh, that hurt. Oh, he lost his balance already. We might just be able to... No, I'm, I'm going to make him heal. I'm going to make him heal. I'm not, I'm not taking this risk. Okay. Nice. Okay. So... When you fight them individually, hit them in the nuts... And then you can take them out pretty quick. Okay. 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 Wait, did we get to heal? Ah, uh, no, we didn't. Let's do that. Healing. Cloth fragment. Use that. Healing. And we'll go. Oh, can I make mixed herbs, actually? Oh, no, I can't. Okay. Um, we'll go healing. We'll use two blue vials. Ah, one will do. One will do. Uh, okay. It's the wasp nest man. It's really sort of annoying that the amount of times you'll spend a key to open a door and there's just nothing there. So you can't, you can't in this game, you just cannot assume that there's always something behind a locked door. There's something there though. God damn it. herb find the recipe yes finally finally we have a recipe book okay okay so we can make vegetable pie we can make a vegetable pie okay And blue vial, sick. No, 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 no. I want mixed herbs. Mixed herbs is way better. Okay. Wooden chest here, and I'm gonna I'm gonna spend a coin on this because I want I want stuff, and I have plenty of coins. So, offers a sword. Fuck yeah. And it's only like one less attack, but it's one-handed. That's really good. Uh, I'm going to give that to Olivia, I think. Yeah, that's way better. No, give it. Yeah, there we go. Nice, 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 nice. That's great. Awesome. That's a good haul. That's worth a key. Feels good. Feels great. A lot of effort having locales in environments. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. The environments are just fantastic in this. Okay, so we can summon the god again if we want to. I don't, I don't know if we really want to summon that god again. I don't know what we really do with him. The radiant one. Okay. Let's go. Oh, someone was hungry. Food. I have a lot of rotten meat. <laughs> Can you do something with rotten meat, I wonder? I need uh, the other recipe book and I can make a shitload of soup, which would be really good. Okay. Okay.
Let's see. Let's see. Oh, Dan is kind of kind of injured, isn't he? Okay, now I have a good haul. Please don't die. Oh, shit. Bremen gas mask, hell yeah. Um, who do I want to survive more? Uh, Olivia or Dan? I say Dan. Bremen gas mask, a little bit more defense. Let's go. Two shillings. Luger, a Luger pistol? What? A toggle locked recoil operated semi automatic pistol, typically used by Bremen army officers as a secondary arm. What? What does that use? What does that use? Um, I'll, I'll equip it on him and it'll show us what, what it uses. The cold pistol grip feels familiar in your hands. You didn't think you'd be grasping grasping one so soon after leaving the front lines. You wonder if you'll ever be able to leave that pass behind. Three shots. Okay, I don't want to deal with the bobby. I can deal with the bobby, I just don't want to. Oh, that's right, Needles is back. God damn it. Okay, so we only have three shots for that. Um, how many for the rifle? 13. Oh, that's loads. Going to equip the spear. Okay. Um, I might save. Where was the bed? Where was the bed? Not that one. Light a candle, comfy. Rest for a bit. Please, 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 please. Yes, nice. Didn't get interrupted. Oh. Still a few people left. Do I have any good boy points? No, I don't. Save. We're in a really good spot at the moment. I think the main issue is going to be time. I think that's only going to be the main issue. Oh, but I think I might actually wrap up for now because we've been playing for four hours. Um, and I think this is a good time to stop. So, let's see, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, thank you guys very much for coming in. I, I appreciate it. Man, this game's so much fun. I just, I, I'm loving it so much. Um, it's just really enjoyable. Um, oh, Cocky's playing Harvester. Hell yeah! Okay, we're gonna raid Cocky because Har if you haven't, if you're unfamiliar with Harvester, somehow you're gonna absolutely. If you like, <laughs> if you like Fear and Hunger, then you'll like Harvester. <laughs> okay. Um, raid into Cocky, and Cocky's great. If you somehow don't know Cocky, Cocky's fantastic. So, yeah. Thank you guys very much for coming in. Um, am I streaming tomorrow? What day is it today? Wednesday. Yes, I am streaming tomorrow. So we'll stream tomorrow as well. And I think I'm getting close to um, getting the last totem. And then the last totem should let me get into the tower. And I think that's an ending. So I might actually get an ending tomorrow. Um, I hope so. It feels like about the right time. Um, but yeah, we'll see how we go. So yeah, see you tomorrow. Um, if anyone here doesn't follow me, I think you all do. But if you don't, follow me on Twitter. Social. Follow me on Twitter because that's where I post all my stuff. So yeah, thank you very much. 
Um, and yeah, see you tomorrow, guys. Oh yeah, look at how fucking rough he looks. It's really funny.